આપણે પ્રાર્થના થી ચાલુ કરીએ વસુદેવ સુતમ દેવ કંસ ચાણુરમર્દનમ દેવકી પરમાનંદમ કૃષ્ણમ વંદે જગત ગુરુ ગુરુ બ્રહ્મ ગુરુ વિષ્ણુ ગુરુ દેવો મહેશ્વર તસ્મય શ્રી ગુરુવે નમ ઓમ શાંતિ 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 Thank you everybody for attending. We have about 28 people and I hope that more and more are going to continue coming in. Our Indian standard time is about 4 hours, so we have about 15-20 minutes here or there, right? We have a lot of time to start our work. And as I mentioned in chat, that Ashok Bhai Vaghani will have a presentation and he is going to lead the session. So I will hand over to him. Okay, Ashok Bhai. I'll mute myself. You can unmute. Okay. Uh, can you hear me? Hello? Uh, what's your name? 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 Let's see if I can close. Hello? Hello? Where's the clock? Where's the clock? Where's the clock? Where's the clock? માઇક્રોફોન <laughs> ચાલે <laughs> 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 તમારે જો કનેક્શન ની જરૂર હોય તો વી કેન પુટ ઇન વેઇટિંગ રૂમ ઓર યુ કેન જસ્ટ ડિસ્કનેક્ટ ઇટ આ જસ્ટ ડિસ્કનેક્ટ ઓલ રાઈટ ઇટ બેટર પરફેક્ટ ઓકે આ સો વેન ઇટ કમ્સ ટુ ધ સર્વે આ યુ કેન હેલ્પ મી કેન યુ સી માય સ્ક્રીન not okay. yet not okay. yet yes already so i think all set now uh thanks everybody for joining uh i don't know the audience um english is okay ke i need to be in gujarati gujarati bolo ke english ma chalse ha to chalo karo but koi mane koi dekha to nahi okay so you can love me hello hello Gujarati. Gujarati? Okay. So, I'm going to try to say Gujarati. I'm going to say that the word is in English. I'm going to say that the word is in English. I'm going to say that. But I'll try my best. Um, yeah, yes, go ahead. Okay. If you say that you're going to say that you're going to say that you're going to say that. Okay so first thing is um sorry uh, medical disclaimer so first of all who doctor nahi i'm engineer and mane potana problem thayla che um bevar 
એટલે આ થોટ કે લેટ મી શેર માય એક્સપિરિયન્સ વિથ યુ અને આઈ મે ઇન્ટરનેટ ઉપરથી બધું ભેગું કર્યું બેસ્ડ અપોન માય એક્સપિરિયન્સ અને આ કરોના સિચ્યુએશનમાં થોડુંક વધારે પ્રોબ્લેમ છે મને અને મને એમ થયું કે આ કુડ બી અ કોમન પ્રોબ્લેમ વધારે થતું હશે આ એટલે પકુલભાઈને વાત કરી અને દેટ્સ આ પ્રેઝન્ટેશન હું કરું છું પણ અગેન હું ડૉક્ટર નથી એટલે હું કોઈ ક્લેમ નથી કરતો કે હું જે કંઈ કહું છું એ બધું વાંચ્યું છે કે યુ વર્ક ફોર યુ એવરીબડી હેઝ અ ડિફરન્ટ ઇસ્યુઝ રાઈટ અને સિમ્ટમ્સ કદાચ હરખા લાગતા હોય મને ઘંબો દુઃખ કરે પણ મારો પ્રોબ્લેમ એ પણ તમારો પ્રોબ્લેમ થતો હોય એટલે હું જ તમને કહેવા માગું છું કે આ જે કંઈ હું ડેમોન્સ્ટ્રેશન કરું છું ને એ સ્ટ્રીકલી ફોર એજ્યુકેશનલ પર્પઝ રાઈટ અને તમે કંઈ દવા લેતા હોય ટ્રીટમેન્ટ કરતા હોય તો ચાલુ રાખવાની એમાંથી જે કંઈ શીખો હોય તમે અપ્લાય કરો પણ તમે જે કંઈ કરો છો અત્યારે એ ચાલુ રાખજો અને આ મારા વિડીયો જોયા પછી પ્રેઝન્ટેશન જોયા પછી તમને કંઈક આડસર થાય તો અગેન દિસ ઇઝ મેડિકલ ડિસ્ક્લેમર ડોન્ટ સુ મી આઈ આમ જસ્ટ ધી મેસેન્જર હિયર રાઈટ એન્ડ એક જેમ બધાને અલગ અલગ પ્રોબ્લેમ હોય અને ઘણી વાર તમારે પોતા રિસર્ચ પણ કરવું પડે જેમને કરવી એમ એટલે યુઝ ધીસ ઇન્ફોર્મેશન એઝ અ ગાઈડલાઇન અને લર્ન સમથિંગ ફ્રોમ હિયર રાઈટ એન્ડ ધેન યુ કેન યુ નો રિસર્ચ ઓન યોર ઓન મેજોરિટી ટાઈમ ને જેટલા લોકોને એટલીસ્ટ મારી જાતે ટ્રીટ કર્યા છે ઓવર ધ ફોન કે પર્સનલી હા એમાંથી મને અમુક સિમ્ટમ્સ મળેલા છે અને એના બેઝ ઉપરથી હું કરું છું પ્લસ અગેન આઈ ડીડ ધ લોટ ઓફ રિસર્ચ ઓન ગૂગલ યુટ્યુબ એન્ડ ઇવન યુ નો આઈ રીડ ધ બુક ઓફ ઓન સબ્જેક્ટ સો ધેટ્સ હાઉ આઈ કેમ અપ વિથ ધીસ ઓકે બાય ક્વેશ્ચન યુ જસ્ટ સીઈંગ માય પ્રેઝન્ટેશન રાઈટ નોટ મી ટ્રીગર acupressure point so hu tumne ena batai is difference ane pachi survey karo ase ke kone kai type no problem che audience ma thi ane pachi hu tumne ene amuk je treating treatment che e tumne hu batai is je ke ton points ton areas che neck upper shoulder and shoulder blade eno tumne kai rite treat karvu e batai this and, and again આ તમારી બેઝ લાઈન છે એજ્યુકેશનમાં અને ધેન યુ કેન ટેક ઇટ ફોર્ધર રાઈટ તમે તમારી જાતે અથવા તો તમારા કોઈ ફેમિલી મેમ્બર્સ હોય એને કહો અને પછી તમે એનાથી આગળ રિસર્ચ કરો એન્ડ ધેન એક્યુપ્રેશરનો અપ્રોચ હોય છે અને ધેટ્સ આવ આઈ એકચુઅલી ગાર ઇન ટુ ધીસ ટ્રીગર પોઈન્ટ આલ એક્સપ્લેન દેર એન્ડ ટાઈમ કાઉન્સ અને પછી ઓન ગોઈંગ કેર ટુ સ્ટે હેલ્ધી આઈ મીન થયું પ્રોબ્લેમ મટી ગયું now how do you make sure that you stay healthy uh, going forward bhagwan aapru sharir che ne evu banayu che ke 40 varsh sudhi to tame aam jata ho right kai problem no aa agal kyunki 40 varsh sudhi kai karvi no hato right i mean chaliye chalu karo to karvano le je agal nu deposit thayelu che and it's all cut out like and again going forward you know how do you have a healthy life right that i'm going to talk about that uh, i'm not going to talk in a detail about you know what you eat and what you don't eat but in terms of ke um so karo but tumara muscle healthy hai right uh and i think i already covered my history of pain but i'll go into detail um ke rite aa chalu thi maru and then ke din tar mahina par i mean aa to chona to tha to
બધા એવો ફોટો તો જોયો જ હશે એમ કઈ રીતનું હોય પણ વી ડોન્ટ પે અટેન્શન કે યા એકની ઉપર બીજું લેયર છે એની અંદર ત્રીજું છે તો વોટ ઇઝ ઇઝ અંડર નીથ છેલ્લે શું છે હાડકા છે રાઈટ તો હાડકાની ઉપર અલગ અલગ જાતના મસલ્સ લગાડી લગાડીને ભગવાને આપણને આવું સ્ટ્રક્ચર આપ્યું છે અને ઉપર સ્કીન આપી છે પણ રિયલમાં અંદર ઘણા બધા મસલના લેયર છે તમને જ્યારે પ્રોબ્લેમ કહો ને કે મને અહીંયા પ્રોબ્લેમ ખબર નથી કે પહેલાં લેયરમાં પ્રોબ્લેમ છે અંદરના લેયરમાં પ્રોબ્લેમ છે કે ઓલ ધ વે જ્યાં હાડકું છે જ્યાં બે હાડકાને ભેગા રાખવા માટે તે મસલ્સ હોય રાઈ એમાં પ્રોબ્લેમ હોય રાઈ મારો પર્સનલ એક્સપિરિયન્સ છે મને એ રીતનો પ્રોબ્લેમ હતો કે જીત હાડકા લેવાનું એમ અને આઈ ફિગર્ડ આઉટ બાય લુકિંગ એટ ધ વિડીયો રાઈટ એટલે યુ નેવર નો તમારો પ્રોબ્લેમ ક્યાં છે એટલે એટલું જાણવું જરૂરી છે કે મસલના લેયરો હોય અને એ બધા જોઈન્ટલી કામ કરતા હોય એક ખેંચે હું આમ આમ હાથ કરું છું તો કે આ એક મસલ નહીં એની જોડે બીજા બીજા મસલ હોય તે સપોર્ટ કરીને ખેંચે છે રાઈટ એટલે જેમ માલગાડી હોય ગુડ સ્ટ્રેન એકબીજા ના ડબ્બાને ખેંચતી ખેંચતી જાય ને એ રીતે આપણા મસલમાં એવું જ હોય ઇટ ઇઝ નોટ વન મસલ વર્ક ઇટ્સ ઓલ મસલ વર્ક ટુગેધર અને દે વર્ક એઝ અ રબર રાઈટ આ પિક્ચરમાં નેકના મસલને બતાવ્યા છે અહીંયા મોટાભાગના જે શોલ્ડરના ઇસ્યુ હોય કે નેકના હોય તો મેઇન પ્રોબ્લેમ નેકમાં જ હોય પછી નીચે ઉતરતો જાય એમ તમે વિચારો કે તમારું માથું અને હોલ બાડી અડધો ભાગ એનો છે એ તો બધી નળીઓમાં ગયો પાછળનો ભાગ જે છે એમાં જ જે કંઈ વાયરિંગ છે ભગવાને કર્યું છે એ એમાં જ છે અને મગજથી કે કોઈ પણ તમારા આમ આમ જોવું હોય ઇટ જસ્ટ વન લિટલ એરિયા હિયર અને એમાં બધા વાયરો નાખ્યા છે મસલ્સની અંદર અને દેટ્સ આ યુર હોલ બાડી ઓપરેટ અને જ્યારે આ પીસ ખરાબ થઈ જાય દેન યુ હેવ અ એન્ટાયર બોડી પ્રોબ્લેમ એટલે ઇટ્સ ગુડ ટુ નો કે કેટલા બધા મસલ હોય તમને એમ કીધું હોય કે ભાઈ મને મસલ દુઃખે છે રાઈટ તો ધારો કે તો E નંબર નું મસલ છે એ ઉપર છે એની અંદર ડી નંબર નું મસલ છે રાઈટ એના કારણે ગો એને નેમ પણ આ પિક્ચર થી તમને હું એટલું કહેવા માંગુ છું ધ મસલ ઇઝ નોટ અ વન લેયર ધ મલ્ટીપલ લેયર એન્ડ યુ કુડ હેવ અ પ્રોબ્લેમ ગમે એ લેયરમાં રાઈટ આ પિક્ચરમાં એક મસલનું આખું સ્ટ્રેન બનાવેલું છે અને એમ કહે છે ને કે ભાઈ એક આંગળીથી કામ ન થાય પંજાથી કરવું પડે સેમ થિંગ એક મસલના સ્ટ્રેન્થથી ના કામ થાય ઇન યુ ટન્સ ઓફ અ મસલ્સ ટુગેધર એન્ડ ધેન યુ નો યુ હેવ અ એબિલિટી ટુ ટુ પુલ બાય તો એક મસલ જે છે એ એક્ઝેક્ટલી રબર ટાઈપની સિચ્યુએશન છે તમે રબરને ખેંચો અને પછી તમે મૂકી દો તો સ્ટ્રેચ થાય કોન્ટ્રાક્ટ થાય નવું બ્રાન્ડ રબર હોય તો તમે ઇઝીલી ખેંચીને મૂકી આપો રાઈટ એની જગ્યાએ પાછું આવી જાય વેઇટ ફોર ધેટ રબર પુટ ધેટ એન આઉટસાઈડ ફોર ફાઈવ ઇયર્સ ફોર મે બી વન ઇયર તડકામાં ગરમીમાં એને મૂકો એન્ડ પછી એ રબરને ખેંચો કદાચ એક જ વાર ખેંચાશે પછી પાછું પાછું હતું ત્યાં ત્યાં નહીં આવે તો લોસ થઈ લાસ્ટ થઈ શકે રાઈટ તો ઓવર ધ પીરિયડ મેં કીધું એમ ચાલી વર્ષ સુધી ભગવાને એવું સરળ બનાવ્યું છે ને કાંઈ પ્રોબ્લેમ ન થાય જનરલી અનલેસ તમને એક્સિડન્ટ કે એવું કંઈક થયું હોય રાઈટ પણ બાય રેગ્યુલર યુઝ તમને ચાલી વર્ષ સુધી કાંઈ ન થાય એમ કેમ કે આ ચાલી વર્ષ સુધી જે આ ભગવાને મસલ બનાવ્યા છે એની જે રબરની લાસ્ટિસિટી છે એની ગેરંટી છે ચાલી વર્ષ સુધી કાંઈ નહીં થાય પછી જ પ્રોબ્લેમ થાય એમ કેમ કે ચાલી વર્ષમાં તમે કઈ રીતે બોડીને ઓપરેટ કરી છે એની ઉપરથી બીજા પાંચ દસ પંદર વીસ વર્ષે ત્રીસ વર્ષે તમને બીજા પ્રોબ્લેમ ચાલુ થાય નેક્સ્ટ પિક્ચરમાં આઈ હેવ અ ક્વેશ્ચન હિયર ક્વીઝ છે રાઈટ તો આ ક્રોસ સેક્શનલ વ્યૂ છે મસલનો મસલ છે એને હું કાપ્યું અને એમાં આગળ જે બતાવ્યું એમ આખું જે ઝૂંડ હતું મસલનું સેમ છે આ વાઇટ વાઇટ પાર્ટ છે ઇઝ બેઝિકલી જે કંઈ ગ્રુપિંગ કરવા માટે બનાવ્યું છે મસલનું ગ્રુપ હોય આખું રાઈટ સ્ટ્રેન બધા અને પછી જે વચ્ચે ક્વેશ્ચન એ છે ક્વિઝનો કે જે ડાર્ક મરૂન પાર્ટ દેખાય છે લેટ મી સી માઉસ મૂવ કરું જો અહીંયા છે અહીંયા છે રાઈટ શું લાગે છે તમને શું હશે શું લાગે છે એ 
ડેમેજ મસલ છે લોહી જામી ગયો હોય એવું લાગે હા ડેમેજ મસલ છે માલગાડી છે એને એન્જિન જર ખેંચવાનું ચાલુ કરે ને તો બધા ડબ્બા જોડે જોડે જવું પડે અને એમાં એકાદો ડબ્બો થોડો વીક હોય તો બાકીના બધા ડબ્બાને હેરાન થાય સેમ થિંગ મસલ માય તે હું જરા હાથ ઊંચો કરું ત્યારે જેટલા મસલ જોઈન્ટ ભેગા થતા હોય એ બધા મસલો અગેન મસલ એક એક સ્ટ્રેન નથી રાય જૂન છે આખા એ આખે આખા જૂન હોય ભેગા થઈને ઊંચા નીચા થવું પડે અને એમાં વચ્ચે આવા લોહી જામી ગયેલા મસલ કે ડેમેજ મસલ તો રાય આગળ હું એનું ટેકનિકલ નામ આપીશ તો આ મસલો આપણને હેરાન કરે તો આ મસલોની જે ગાંઠો છે એને જ આપણે હરખી કરવાની એક વાર હરખી થઈ જાય ને તો તમે કહો બીજું કઈ નથી જે મસલના પ્રોબ્લેમો કહે છે ને લોકો ત્યાં મસલ પ્રોબ્લેમ લોકો એમ કે એ અમારે મસાજ કરાવવો પડશે કેમ કે ઉપરના જે મસલ છે અમુક એ ટાઈટ થઈ ગયા ટાઈટ એટલે શું ટાઈટ એટલે ઇલાસ્ટિસિટી જતી રહે એમ ઇલાસ્ટિસિટી પાછી લાવવી પડે એમ પહેલાં તો એની જે મસલની ગાંઠ હોય એને આપણે વગાવવી પડે ગમે એમ કરીને પછી પહેલાં તો શોધવી પડે વગાવવી પડે અને પછી મેન્ટેન કરવી પડે રાઈટ કેમ કે જ્યારે ડેમેજ મસલ થઈ ગયા હોય ને એટલે જલ્દી તમે રિપેર કરો ને તો એ જલ્દી ડેમેજ થવાના છે કેમ કે એની ટેન્ડન્સી એવી થઈ ગઈ છે કે ચાલી વર્ષ સુધી આપણે એને ઘુમડ્યા રાખ્યા આડું અડું અને એનો મિસયુઝ કર્યો અને પછી એ ડેમેજ થયા છે તો રિપેર કરતા એ વાર લાગે તમે થોડી વાર ટેમ્પરરી મને કહેવાય મટીરિયલ પછી તમે ચાલુ કરી દો પાછું લેબર વર્ક કે ઓવર યુઝ ઓફ માસા હોય આમ બીજા પાછળ કહું તો તો ફરી પાછું એ બે ચાર છ મહિનામાં વહી હોય ને એ પરિસ્થિતિ થવા લાગી રાખે હું આ ટેકનિકલ વસ્તુનું કામ બતાવવા માંગુ છું એ તમને ખબર પડે કે એકચ્યુઅલ મસલ્સના પ્રોબ્લેમ મસલ શું છે કઈ રીતના કન્સિસ્ટ થયેલા છે કઈ ટાઈપની નાટ્સ હોય અંદર યુ ટ્રીટ ધ નાટ એન્ડ ધેન યુ મેન્ટેન યોર બાડી ગોઈંગ ફોરવર્ડ એક વખતનો પ્રોબ્લેમ સોલ્વ થઈ જાય આઈ એમ ટ્રાઈંગ ટુ એક્સપ્લેન યુ ફોર એવર ધેટ યુ નો યુ લર્ન ઓન યોર ઓન એન્ડ વી હેવ પાવર નેક્સ્ટ પિક્ચર સોર મસલ આ પિક્ચરમાં નેકનો મસલ અહીંનો મસલ છે લાલ બતાવ્યો છે એનો મતલબ એવો થયો કે ત્યાં પેઇન છે હવે એનું તમે માઇક્રોસ્કોપમાં કે વડે બોલ તમે ફોટો પાડીને જોવો અંદર તો યુ સી એન બાળમ અને સર્કલ વોટ યુ થિંક વોટ યુ સી દેર આઈ એમ આસ્કિંગ ક્વેશ્ચન ના સો પેલું લાલ લાલ જે બધું બતાવે છે રાઈટ પેલું મુરલી જેવું રાઈટ અને વચ્ચે સ્ટ્રેટ સ્ટ્રેટ છે તો વોટ ઇઝ દેર છે વચ્ચેનું જે મુરલી છે પાતળી સ્ટ્રેચ મસલ ફાઈબર ગો બેક ટુ ધેટ રબર એક્ઝામ્પલ બ્રાન્ડ ન્યુ રબર છે ઇટ લુક્સ ગુડ ઇવન રાઈટ બધી બાજુથી સ્ટ્રેચ કરો હંડ્રેડ પર્સન્ટ સ્ટ્રેચ હરખું થાય એક પરત બહાર મૂકો પછી એ રબરને જુઓ ગાંઠા ગાંઠા થઈ ગયા હશે પછી તમે સ્ટ્રેચ કરો તો અમુક જગ્યાએથી વધારે સ્ટ્રેચ થાય અમુક જગ્યાએથી ઓછું સ્ટ્રેચ થાય આ જ હાલત આ મસલની થઈ છે જ્યાં નોટ છે જ્યાં ગાંઠ છે એની પાછળનો ભાગ છે ને એ શું થયો છે વધારે બધો ખેંચાઈ ગયો છે સ્ટ્રેચ થઈ ગયો છે એમ બીજો કે મસલ અંદર આવવાનો નથી જે કંઈ છે ને એની એનો શેપ બગડી ગયો એની સ્ટ્રેચ થઈ ગયો હવે જ્યાં સ્ટ્રેચ થાય ને મસલ ત્યાં ગિવિંગ યુ ફેન અને સ્ટ્રેચની આગળ ગાંઠ હોય બંને સાથે જ હોય એમ એટલે ગાંઠ થઈ ને પછી તો એ સ્ટ્રેચ થવાનો છે ગાંઠ છે એ ખુલવાની નથી તમે જ્યારે રબરને ખેંચો ગાંઠ થઈ ગઈ હોય એ ખુલવાની નથી એટલે ગાંઠની પછીનો જે ભાગ છે ને એ સ્ટ્રેચ થવાનો લાંબો થવાનો અનનેસેસરી લાંબો થવાનો એન્ડ ધેટ લૂઝ ઇન યોર સ્ટ્રેન્થ એના તો બોલ સાહેબ જે ગાંઠ છે એ મુરલીનો મોટો ભાગ છે એના જેવું લાગે છે રાઈટ અને આમાં હેલ્ધી મસલ કયું લાગે છે તમને તો પ્રોબ્લેમ મસલની વાત કરી હેલ્ધી મસલ ઇઝ ઓલ સ્ટ્રેટ નો ગાંઠ નો મુરલી દેટ્સ યોર હેલ્ધી મસલ આઈડિયલી બધા મસલ આવા હોવા જોઈએ આવા જો હોય ને તો તમને પેઇન ન થાય ક્વેશ્ચન શું છે ગાંઠો ગાંઠો ક્યાંથી પડી જાય 
આપણે અલગ અલગ પોઝિશનમાં કામ કરતા હોય કેટલાક લોકો કમ્પ્યુટર માં નામ કર્યા હતા કેટલાક લોકો હાથ લાંબા હોય ટૂંકા હોય કે બીજા કોઈ ફોનના યુઝમાં આખો દિવસ આમ આમ કર્યા કરતા હોય દળાનો ભાગ છે ઇટ્સ વન કોમન પાઇપલાઇન ફ્રોમ મીન ટોપ ટુ બાડમ રાઇટ એટલે એ ઇન્જર્ડ થવાની છે જ આપણે અનનેસેસરી ઓવર લોડ કરીએ છીએ નેકને અને આ ખંભાને મસાવાનું એટલે આ પરિસ્થિતિ ઊભી થાય છે મોટાભાગે તમે જોજો ને તો ફ્રોઝન શોલ્ડર હશે ફ્રોઝન નેક હશે પણ ફ્રોઝન લેગ નહીં હોય વાય બીકોઝ લેગ યુઝઅલી વર્ક લેગ યુઝઅલી ડઝન્ટ સી કમ્પ્યુટર કે લેપટોપ કે જે કંઈ ફોન ને રાઇટ એટલે એનો મિસયુઝ ઓછો થાય છે મિસયુઝ ને નિયમ ન થાય છે હાથ ન થાય છે રાઇટ એમ કમ્પ્યુટર વાળા કામ કરવા વાળા હોય એને એની પોઝિશનથી થાય છે એમ અને તમે માનતા હોય ને કે આજે મને પ્રોબ્લેમ નથી તો ઓવર યુઝ તમે કરતા રહેશો ને તો કાલ પ્રોબ્લેમ થશે એમ અકુલભાઈ એક પેલું ઘઉં મુખાસન કરાવે છે આ વાત કરીને આ વાત કરીને રાઇટ એમ અને એમાં મારા પોતાને એક એક સાઈડ કરું ને હું તો હંડ્રેડ પર્સન્ટ મેચ થઈ જાય એમ બીજી બાજુ કરું ને તો આટલી ગેપ છે એમ વાહ that's because that's out of the muscle has a knot knot na gaane j is stretch nahi hota bakul bhai bachche kehta ke tumhe rumal vapro ke game the string ki khanch ho right par ye atli had a knot thai gayi che aatma mare ke ye possible ad nahi ye jo khanchwa jao rumal thi to kada to rumal phati jaye athava maru muscle torn thai jaye atli had na ek tight che par This week, આ વીકમાં મને બીજી એક ઇન્ફોર્મેશન મેં રિસર્ચ કરી છે સ્ટ્રિક્ટલી આની કે અમે ફોકસ હવે આઈ હેવ અ ગોલ કે જે આ આમ નહીં થતું મારાથી રાઈટ એ હું કરી દઈશ એમ વિધિન ધ મંથ એમ ધેટ્સ વોટ માય ટાર્ગેટ ઇઝ નાઉ એટલે આ અત્યારે તો હું આને કરું જ છું આ રાઈટ એમ ઘણું થાય છે પણ આમ કરવા જાઉં તો ઇઝ નો વેર નિયર એમ અગેન ધેટ્સ બીકોઝ આઈ હેવ અ ટાઈટ મસલ હિયર and i'm going to work on the method that i'm going to explain you next okay so next part is um the trigger point so trigger point is nothing but a tense muscle fiber you can see in a picture a uh, uh, shoulder blade no in a photo padelo che a ek video ma thi and i'm i'm going to show you a video so અને એમાં જે વચ્ચે સર્કલ છે એ એ શું કહેવાય એફી સેન્ટર છે અને ત્યાંથી ધીમે ધીમે કેર ના લીધી એટલે એ જે મસલ હોય બાજુનું મસલ એનું એનું બે બાજુનું મસલ એન્સ ઓવરઓલ એ ફૂલ સ્ટ્રેચ થઈ ગયું છે અને એકવાર એ એક લાઇનમાં મસલ ના પ્રોબ્લેમ ચાલુ થાય ને પછી એ સાઈડમાં સ્પ્રેડ થાય બિકોઝ એ એરિયા તમારો ઓલમોસ્ટ અનયુઝેબલ થઈ ગયો તમે કીધું એને કે હું આ ખેંચું ના આમાં મને નહીં આ દુખે છે એ મારે નથી કરવું રાઈટ એમ કરવાનું તમે ચાલુ કરો ને એટલે ધીમે ધીમે સરાઉન્ડિંગ એરિયાઝ પણ ડેડ થવા માંડે અને દેન યુ જસ્ટ લીવ કે ઓ મને એ હાથ દુખે કે મને એ પગ દુખે કે મને મારી ગરદન દુખે એ નથી એ હાથેથી હું કામ નહીં કરી શકું એમ ધેટ્સ આ અવર મેન્ટાલિટી એન્ડ વી સ્ટાર્ટ યુઝિંગ ધેટ વી ઓલ્સો ડોન્ટ ફિક્સ ધ પ્રોબ્લેમ રાઈટ એન્ડ દેન વર્ક ઓન ધ સેકન્ડ હેન્ડ and then have a problem on a second hand too sorry i'm kind of not diverting a little bit but i'm trying to show the frustration that people has right etle emotion mein thoda aa jao so anyway uh so what is a trigger point trigger point is not acupressure point um acupressure ma so ke ke tumhe ahiya dabao to tumne ahiya problem ho ane mati jaye right ધારો કે આંગળીઓ દબાવો પગમાં દબાવો તો રૂટ કોઝ ત્યાં છે ઇફેક્ટ અહીંયા આવે એને એને રિફર પેઇન કહેવાય રાઈટ કે એક જગ્યાએ દબાવો બીજી જગ્યાએ પ્રોબ્લેમ સોલ્વ થાય એમ ન ટ્રિગર પોઈન્ટ ઇઝ નોટ ધેટ ટ્રિગર પોઈન્ટ ઇઝ જ્યાં પ્રોબ્લેમ છે જ ત્યાં દબાવો કોમનલી એવું કહેવાય કે આ તમે બધી નસો પગમાં ભેગી થતી હોય અથવા તો હાથમાં ભેગી થતી હોય રાઈટ તો યા તમે અહીંયા દબાવો તો જનરલી આ જે કંઈ એની પાઇપલાઇન હોય એ હેલ્પ કરે 
જ્યારે તમારે આ ફોટામાં દેખાય એવો પ્રોબ્લેમ હોય તો આંગળીએ ગમે ત્યાં દબાવો પ્રોબ્લેમ સોલ્વ ન થાય એમ મેં બહુ દબાવી છે એમ પ્રોબ્લેમ સોલ્વ ન થયો ન થાય કેમ કે જે પરિસ્થિતિ જે અગલીને આ નોટની છે એ ગમે તો દબાવો ને એનાથી સોલ્વ ન થાય તો વોટ યુ નીડ યુ પે અટેન્શન એટ ધ નાટ નાટ સમવેર આ બટ ઇટ સ્ટીલ હેલ્પ્સ સો ઓન ગોઈંગ તમારે હેલ્ધી રહેવું હોય તો ત્યાં બધું દબાવો એમ પણ જ્યારે પ્રોબ્લેમ હદની બહાર પહોંચી જાય ને પછી તમારે ટુ ધ પોઈન્ટ અટેન્શન લેવું પડે એમ તો ટ્રિગર પોઈન્ટ ઇઝ અ ટેન્સ મસલ ફાઈબર કોન્ટ્રાક્ટેડ નાટ્સ લોસ ઓફ અટેન્ડરનેસ સો તમે ક્યાંક દબાવો આમ તમે ધારો કે કોઈ જોવું હોય કે કોઈ વસ્તુ કઠણ છે કે કોઈ વસ્તુ ઓછી છે ઢીલી છે તો એ જસ્ટ કમ્પેર આ બંને બાજુ દબાવો અને તમને યુ ફીલ જેને સ્ટીફ મસલ હોય ને એને જ ખબર હોય કે કેટલા કડક થઈ જાય છે મસલ તમે આમ દબાવો ને ત્યાં ખબર પડે રાઈટ તો દેટ્સ અનધર વે ટુ ફાઇન્ડ વેરી યોર ટ્રિગર પોઈન્ટ આમ કરે શો યુ સો આપણે પ્રેક્ટિકલ કરશું આ પતી જાય એમ ઓણ મેક શ્યોર કે તમે થિયોરિટિકલ જે નોલેજ છે એ તમને આવે એટલે તમે યુ પે મોર અટેન્શન ઓન અ પ્રેક્ટિકલ પાર્ટ એન્ડ યુ લર્ન ઓન યોર ઓન દેટ ઇઝ અ ગોલ રાઈટ મસલ સોરી ધી ટ્રિગર પોઈન્ટ તમારા શરીરમાં હોય મને તો સપોઝ કે અહીંયા ટ્રિગર પોઈન્ટ છે મારે પણ આઈ કેન નોટ સી બીકોઝ દેટ વેરી ડીપ ઇન્સાઈડ ધ મસલ રાઈટ એટલે દેખાય નહીં તમને પણ પેશન્ટ જે હોય ને એ આમ આમ કરે ને તેને ફીલ થાય એમ સો અગેન આપણે એક્સરસાઇઝમાં એ જોઈશું એમ એન્ડ કે બી ટ્રીટેડ બાય યોર ઓન અને બુક્સ પણ છે મેં પોતે આ બુક્સ વાંચેલી છે આઈ ડોન્ટ નો ઇફ યુ કેન સી યોર નાટ પણ આ બુક માંથી તો આ બુક મેં ઘણા વર્ષો પહેલાં વાંચેલી અને દેટ્સ આવ આઈ સ્ટાર્ટ એડ લર્નિંગ ઓન ટ્રીગ પોઈન્ટ so the next is um i want to show you um some animated videos uh it's all in english of course um par tumne kada photo ma thi vadare idea aave je loko ne english ma samjha na padti hoy ekada photo jo nahi thase there are short videos 2 to 3 minutes uh but it's worth before we do our own exercise tumhe pote feel karo jab tumhe video jovo ne tar tumhe tamaru je attention che એ તમારા બોડીમાં લાવજો સપોઝ કે તમે વિડીયો જુઓ છો શોલ્ડરનો જુઓ છો તો ફીલ યોર પેઇન ઇફ યુ હેવ અ પેઇન ઇન યોર શોલ્ડર રાઈટ એન્ડ દેન કમ્પેર અને દેન યુ સ્ટાર્ટ થિંકિંગ કે ભાઈ મારે કથા જવું હશે રાઈટ તો તમને એટલી આઈડિયા આવવાનો ચાલુ થાય અને પછી નેક્સ્ટ વેન વી ડૂ ધ એક્સરસાઇઝ એ હેલ્પ યુ એમ ઓકે લેટ મી શેર માય વિડીયોઝ નાઉ let me know if you can see my uh, youtube can you can you see my youtube yes yes okay cool all right so this is only 1 minute and 12 second videos okay and uh, akul bhai anybody let me know if you cannot hear the audio okay Trigger points are caused by muscle injury. Muscles can be injured suddenly in accidents, or damage can occur slowly, due to repeated movements or poor posture. A muscle is composed of tiny fibers, which contract and relax in response to messages from the brain. When muscle fibers become injured or overstimulated, they cannot relax and form contraction knots. A trigger point consists of many contraction knots where individual muscle fibers contract and cannot relax. Fibers extending from the trigger point to the muscle attachments shorten and form a tight band. The persistent contraction of muscle fibers compresses blood vessels and decreases their blood supply, leading to oxygen starvation and the accumulation of waste products. This irritates nerves and causes pain. activated pain receptors generate specific preferred pain patterns 
depending on nerve passage and muscle anatomy. Distance has been on all of our minds lately. That we've been too close to some. Many people suffer from pain and physical problems. Very few people know that these problems are often related to trigger points. Understanding and treating trigger points helps to lessen pain and improve overall health. This video is a short explanation and introduction to the trigger point. A trigger point is a small muscle contraction which can be felt as a small nodule. Pushing on this nodule is very painful. Trigger points can exist in each muscle of the body. Multiple can exist at the same time. Often both sides of the body are affected equally. The trigger point keeps the muscle tight and weak, restricting the muscle's range of motion. A trigger point can actively cause pain, or it can cause no pain unless touched. Mostly this pain is sent to a different area of the body. This is called referred pain. Referred pain can make finding and treating trigger points difficult. Luckily, referred pain follows typical patterns that have been well documented. Let's take a closer look at the trigger point. A trigger point lies in a taut band. The taut band is a tight strand of muscle that feels like a cord, easily mistaken for a tendon. The trigger point itself can be felt with the fingertips when its location is superficial. The size varies from a pinhead to a pea. When we continue to zoom in, we can see the muscle fibers that make up the muscle. The lines on the muscle fibers represent sarcomeres. Millions of sarcomeres acting like tiny pumps have to contract to create movement. Sarcomeres can become overstimulated and unable to release their contracted state. This knot of contracted sarcomeres shows a segment of the fiber that has become shorter and wider because of this. But also a different segment now becomes stretched by this tension, shown by the greater distance between the sarcomeres. Together multiple of these sarcomere knots form the trigger point. The stretched segments of the fibers give tightness to the taut band in which the trigger point lies. When sarcomeres are stuck in contraction, blood flow stops in the immediate area. The resulting oxygen starvation and accumulation of waste products irritate the trigger point. The trigger point responds by sending out pain signals. In return, your brain will stimulate you to stop using the muscle, which further shortens and tightens up the muscle. Trigger points will not release without proper treatment. The most effective way to treat a trigger point is applying deep stroking massage directly to the trigger point. This can be done without the help of others. Deep stroking massage means performing a series of deep strokes across the trigger point nodule. In this example, a rubber bouncing ball is placed between the body and the wall to reach the trigger point in the lower trapezius on the back side of the body. You can see the ball moving slowly and deeply in short strokes from one side of the trigger point to the other. Series typically consist of about 8 to 12 strokes and are performed about 5 to 10 times a day. By using deep stroking massage you are milking the trigger point so to speak. Blood and lymph fluid is moved out containing waste generated by the contracted muscle fibers. Each time you move over the trigger point and release the pressure, fresh blood immediately flows in bringing fresh oxygen and nutrients. It may take several weeks to return the muscle fibers to the normal state and fully release the trigger point. Trigger points which have existed for a long time will take a lot of treatment, but often results can be achieved in days, meaning less pain and improved mobility. You can find references to more in-depth information about trigger points and their treatment in the video description below. When school is in a place you have to What is a muscle trigger point? Here is a normal muscle. Muscles consist of fibers that are attached at each end by tendons to the bones of a movable joint. The fibers within a normal muscle are uniform in size with aligned sarcomeres that give the muscle its strided appearance. 
the sarcomeres contract and relax in coordination to move the joint. By contrast, a muscle trigger point is a painful hard knot comprised of damaged fibers within a muscle. The damaged fibers are also referred to as taut bands. Here is a view of a trigger point with several different types of taut bands. Due to injury or inflammation or physical or emotional stresses, some fibers within a muscle undergo a localized hypercontraction of their sarcomeres. Here is the width of a normal sarcomere. Nearby sarcomeres within the affected fiber are stretched to compensate for the hypercontracted sarcomeres at the trigger point. The more hypercontracted the sarcomeres in the knot, the more stretch there is to the adjacent sarcomeres and the greater the number of sarcomeres that are distressed overall. The sarcomeres in the knot are essentially fixed in this hypercontracted state by damage to those biochemical and structural mechanisms that normally produce muscle contraction. In response, the distressed sarcomeres release chemicals that induce inflammation at the trigger point. The released chemicals sensitize the nerve pain receptors called nociceptors that transmit pain signals from the central nervous system. And they also transfer the pain signals to other pain receptors to produce referred pain in other parts of the body where there's no actual damage or inflammation. In addition, the partial contraction of one or more fibers also puts a tension at their points of juncture with the tendon and causes more tenderness from the unrelieved tension. In essence, the formation of muscle trigger points is a significant and common source of chronic pain. Unfortunately, muscle trigger points are also not frequently discussed as a source of pain and are not frequently diagnosed, since diagnosis is by subjective examination by palpation rather than a definitive clinical test. We will next discuss why some sarcomeres undergo hypercontraction and the biochemical and structural features of a trigger point. I have our last video. You want to know why running on the... Myofascial pain syndrome is a common chronic pain disorder that can affect various parts of the body. Myofascial pain syndrome is characterized by presence of hyper-irritable spots located in skeletal muscles called trigger points. A trigger point can be felt as a band or a nodule of muscle with harder than normal consistency. Palpation of trigger points may elicit pain in a different area of the body. This is called referred pain. Referred pain makes diagnosis difficult as the pain mimics symptoms of more well-known common conditions. For example, trigger point related pain in the head and neck region may manifest as tension headache, temporomandibular joint pain, eye pain, or tinnitus. Symptoms of myofascial pain syndrome include regional persistent pain, commonly associated with limited range of motion of the affected muscle. The pain is most frequently found in the head, neck, shoulders, extremities, and lower back. Trigger points are developed as a result of muscle injury. This can be acute trauma caused by sport injury, accidents, or chronic muscle overuse brought by repetitive occupational activities, emotional stress, or poor posture. A trigger point is composed of many contraction knots where individual muscle fibers contract and cannot relax. These fibers make the muscle shorter and constitute a taut band, a group of tense muscle fibers extending from the trigger point to muscle attachments. The sustained contraction of muscle sarcomeres compresses local blood supply, resulting in energy shortage of the area. This metabolic crisis activates pain receptors, generating a regional pain pattern that follows a specific nerve passage. The pain patterns are therefore consistent and are well documented for various muscles. Treatment of myofascial pain syndrome aims to release trigger points and return the affected muscle to original length and strength. Common treatment options include 
Manual therapy, such as massage, involves application of certain amounts of pressure to release trigger points. The outcome of manual therapy strongly depends on the skill level of the therapist. The spray and stretch technique makes use of a vapor coolant to quickly decrease skin temperature while passively stretching the target muscle. A sudden drop in skin temperature provides a pain relief effect, allowing the muscle to fully stretch and thus releasing the trigger points. Trigger point injections with saline, local anesthetics, or steroids are well accepted as effective treatments for myofascial trigger points. Dry needling, insertion of a needle without injecting a solution, is reported to be as effective as injections. So in case, um, Kone Agal wants to war, so you can also do the uh, Wikipedia uh, official trigger point. So there are lots of materials available uh, for trigger point, as a trigger point. And some of your link more please. Um, and some of your video just on the Bajuma Vija, YouTube already recommend your video too, right? I mean, would you want to go make the minimum more and to the point where I want to know you about that the hundreds of videos available uh, that you can see in the detail, right? Uh, treatment for one, directly treatment all over the world. So this is the last video of the video. You can do manual um, therapy, right? Uh, which we will do today. I mean, um, BG, dry needling, if you want, I avoid that. Uh, okay, this the trigger point is, can vary, right? As you know, the So, regard that, try finding on your own. Well, first of all, have a, you know, a better lifestyle, not abuse your neck. Um, if you have a chronic, you know, pain because of the posture, right? Can be to a right? Um, get a local, you know, pro for that, but I come to a new too, right? So just avoid that, uh, but that's okay. But then continuously cut down and you're damaging your muscle. And again, under 14 a problem with you, over 14 is a problem for one answer. Uh, so this picture says where you can find the trigger point. So tell me you put on up, I mean the video map on. Uh, every muscle, so pay attention to your video map, okay. Every muscle can have a trigger point. Uh, neck, shoulder, humidity, right? Uh, from the journey, up to focus, just over here, uh, shoulder blade, shoulder uh, arm, and then the neck, right? And can't fix the closer shoulder, no problem. Right? Hip no problem. So, so yeah, they, they might have a sort of problem with the trigger point there too. Depends, you know, what you get right? So majority time, modern knowledge, the trigger point, generate kiam thai. Injury they were some of use karano or chukar or any stretchability jason muscle in your chip or whatever reason or other way some of the abuse karano overuse karano like neck or something you were overuse karano right so I have problems okay I'll go back to my rubber example rubber shape some man can't you look at you can't you look at you that's fine the can't you can't you rock off the shimmuk off the original position of Bashan yeah same with the upper body in the rest to you, I have never to you, neck in the rest to you. Come here, rest at your other continuously long hours come for all. But then it loses the stretchability and eventually you have a double muscle there. And then start you know, building knots, right? Which you can reduce by the year. Don't overdo it. Have a break. Now, um, how can I find trigger point? Um, again, it's just stiff muscle, right? I mean, compare to a delusia, a cut of shape, right? Probably that's the problem. There could be a trigger point there, right? We'll have exercise, so don't worry. Um, next is um, I want to know uh, from the audience. Again, I cannot see the audience now, but let me try. Uh, I can now. Um, 
I want to know from the audience how many of you have a problem with a, in the neck. Can you make my problem or a upper shoulder? Um, can a uh, upper shoulder my or a problem, right? At my my a problem in the upper shoulder and a pachi on the back, right? So again, let's start. Um, I'm trying to see now everybody, okay? Okay, so let's go with the number one. If possible, please uh, turn the camera on, if possible. Right. Because there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, about nine, eight, seven, seven cameras still off. So we don't know whether you raise the hand or not. And and I think one issue at a time, right? Okay. So we can come. So we're talking only now, okay? This would be on. Okay, Jimmy, I'll tell you too, right? Uh, over there, right? Neck must take on it, okay? Uh, again, I just want to know the audience, right? So uh, let's see. Um, I can count. Um, you can count. So I see like a half a hand here. Yeah. And uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, so I would say half of the audience has a neck problem, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so now let's go to the next one. Um, the, the shoulder, right? So which is, as a, okay, well, uh, gardan in niche, right? And a half map on a half map on a photo, but I have a problem, right? So again, some um, go mukas and bakul by karaway or anything, right? Ek hathe tatu and ek hathe na tatu and you have a hidden problem that you don't want. So raise your hand in, the, in that case. Uh, number two. Okay, so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think about 11 or 12, maybe about the same figure. Same figure? Okay, so we have a, another half audience. And then, some of you have a neck problem. Could be anywhere, right? Because some of you have a video, report thing. Problem is you have a up, right? Yeah. I mean, it's all about finding a point. And, and I guarantee everybody, you know, who raised the hand and multiple knocks. I had a multiple knocks. I still have multiple knocks, right? Uh, okay, so let's go with the third now, which is down below on the shoulder blade, right? So somewhere here, right? Less people have their problem. Uh, I, I just want to know uh, the audience. Number three. One, two, three. Not that popular, maybe four. Not that popular, okay. All right. So, and then my next question is, I want to know like the healthy people, right? So I see one, um, Nitesh. One, two, three, four. Five, I think five, including me. Okay, all right. So that means you don't have a problem at all or you, you have a problem elsewhere, right? But anyway, uh, I'm not gonna discuss further uh, where you have a problem. But now that you know, and hope, get me that video, right? That I may start realizing and connecting those videos with your own pain and start at least, you know, mentally finding, yeah, right? Okay, so, um, okay, now, we can go to the next one now. So treating your pain is, yeah. So again, this is my own technique I developed myself, uh, helped me a lot. Uh, and uh, I'm just sharing, it may, may work for you, I may not, right? But, to me, paying attention to this subject, again, paying attention to this subject itself is gonna start to you know, motivate you to look further rather than, yeah, I'm gonna have to treat you, so look for it. But they were still like, look for it, and they were just right? No, don't treat like that, right? You know, try to dig in, right? And figure out, you know, what could be the problem? I'm not there alone, right? You see the video, right? After you clean up, I'm gonna have any problems here. It's a science there too. Yeah. And then dig in if needed, right? But again, 
how to get the jump start. That's what I'm gonna show you, okay? Next step, PO. You need to work hard on your problem, right? I'm just the messenger here, I'll just show you, right? Okay, so procedure to find the trigger point for the neck. And uh, I know I told you guys, okay, um, oil, they want to say, uh, don't apply, okay? And then, uh, okay, middle oil, the one that I said, and then best you, pencil oil, and then the user no area oil, and it works pretty good, uh, so no quick pain for me time. So first, again, I'm not able to see you guys uh, because I have this laptop screen, okay? So do on your own, I'll give you enough time. Let's do bare neck massage without oil, without anything. As you put on a batai vishay, here it no. Slowly, go lead, see if you can find trigger point in the neck area. Now, jene bare number no problem ato ne, Area kare. Even my recommendation is bada kare. Yeah, ke je healthy oil is super healthy, right? And then no karu oil to choose se. But jene pon koi pon problem che related to one, two, or three, they all do this because remember, referred pain and actual pain is a different area. You might have a pain here. It could be trigger point here or vice versa, right? So let's not go into detail, but I want to do this exercise. <laughs> I would all, I would say patience, right? If you're healthy, you can feel. So first with a bare hand, try, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll count, let's say the timing wise, right? But let's say, you know, we give you a 90 seconds, okay? Uh, and see, you know, if you can find some knot with bare hand, okay? So how you find it? So slowly, all the way, Neck to uh, while you under the one, right? Like a muscle is still here, too. Okay, so can you see this? Hello, yes, okay. Actually, um, I, 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 I try to, yeah, actually, I try to, I try to change the screen view. So, right now, we try to watching you in a, in a big screen, and the share is just like small screen at the side. Okay. I don't know if everybody able to see that way or just me, but I just change on my screen. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. We cannot see. Okay, so you can you can move the slider, you can top right corner, you can click on view and you can change uh, like um, side by side and you can say side by side speaker. Then you get the slide bar, you can just move on one side. So speaker view can be a bigger and share screen will be a small on the side. So then you can just adjust the screen. Okay, so I'll give you another 10 seconds uh, to adjust. Okay, how about if I stop sharing? But if I stop sharing, I cannot read. Okay, all right. So, let's stop. So again, with the bare hand, uh, start kind of, uh, you know, pressuring. You have to do a medium pressure, okay, with your thumb. Um, so let me show here first. So just like this, you press that, right? And then you press, you know, another uh, area, right? And then how do you find the tight muscle? Well, compared to the soft muscle. So the tenderness chair muscle, right? It may not be cover, but oh, I put a product like that, right? Or well, maybe it gives me a pain too, right? So that's the indication that you have something wrong there, right? And pressure I'm gonna move karwani, right? Yeah. And I start from the bottom. So I'll show you here. So for example, this, right? So with the both hands, you go on and then go all the way up and then try again. So cover. Then you can do the side way too. So any possible way you can find the the thought band case and alcohol. Yeah, any possible way of find that, right? Okay, now I'll give you 90 seconds to, to try, okay?
Okay, so I think everybody has tried at least once, right? So it was a 60 second, but that's okay. Um, now, next step is you probably found something or maybe you couldn't find anything. Uh, majority of time, yeah, I need equation A, you said, right? And so now the next step, which is the use of uh, lubrication, right? Um, oil tea, I mean, the past 60 seconds, I mean, the past 60 seconds, oil tea will make, you know, easy to find the, uh, the thought build or the, uh, the trigger point, right? So all you need to do is, you know, take a little bit of a drop, right? Uh, I use a spray because I use this last. Um, so I just apply a couple of drops, right? You rub it, right? You just rub nicely, right? Um, you just apply, right? So about your shoulder, you apply there too. Um, and make sure that it's enough lubricated, right? Now, next step is try again. Whatever you did in the past 60 seconds, try again. You can also use like two or three fingertips, right? Like this, right? And then you, you try like this. Can you see my You just want to make sure. Okay, cool. So you try, you try like that. Now let's say that I found something here. Let's say I found something here, okay? But then I'm gonna say, oh yeah, maybe it's a suspicious here, right? So then you start, you know, you need to isolate that knot. Um, once you find the, the tight muscle, and you continuously rub with your fingers, and you will find a knot. And a knot chan a magna dana jivi also. I had that magna dana jivi knot like a, eight years ago, and when I applied, fixed it, I was like in a new person. So just pay more attention in the tight muscle. You will find it, believe me. So I'll give you some time because it's first time you are doing, right? So let's say another 30 seconds. Once you find it, it not okay, okay, I have one here. Then you continuously look for the second one. And if second one is more harder, more painful than the first one, then well, you pay more attention there. Right, uh, but my experience is um, whoever has a problem, they have a multiple knots. I mean, uh, it's just one harder, stronger, more painful than the other. But there are multiple, right? Okay. So now, anybody able to find? Raise your hand. Anybody able to find the tight muscle? Let's start with that first. Anybody? Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I see a few hands raised. Okay. So, uh, hey, uh Ashok Bhai. Huh? So, tight muscle mala je parat me je naatni vaat karo je ne? Ke magna dana je Like, I have a shoulder pain, but like, I don't see that kind of a knot. So, like, what do you suggest? So, you just have to keep going it deep. So let's say that you have one inch area, right? Right. Now you continuously use your fingertip, right? And you have to use oil, right? But if you have to use your hands, then you don't have to use your hands. And if you have to use your fingers without oil, and with oil, did you find any difference? With no, I think. As I said, that my chin is stiff muscle. Man, I am worried, but man, not nothing more. That's the reason I got confused. Because no, no, man, it's hard. And in the first time, again, you doing the first time, I believe, right? Right. But you just have to focus. I mean, that's why I'm saying, try it, try it, right? And if you, and if you are sure that you, this is another point for everybody. That you have taken some position that was very difficult. I mean, suppose I am on the left side, so I am very tired. So, in this position, I will try to find it, right? 
અને પછી એ અગેન મસલ્સ ના લેયર છે રાઈટ તો તમે જ્યારે પોઝિશન ચેન્જ કરો ને તો એ વખતે કદાચ હોય એ બહાર આવી જાય રાઈટ અને તમને પકડાવ પકડાઈ શકે તમે અને યુ કેન ફાઈન્ડ ઇટ રાઈટ તો આવું કે તમે કીધું અને અગેન ઇટ જસ્ટ મેટર ઓફ ટાઈમ યુ નો કીપ કીપ ડિગિંગ ઇન એન્ડ સપોઝ કે નથી મળતો તો મારી દ્રષ્ટિ ઓકે આઈ એમ નોટ ટ્રાઈંગ ટુ સ્કેર યુ બટ યુ કુડ હેવ a bigger problem right i mean je mug kau chu nu that the bottom line and the need is always a mug right for the surrounding area che tame bija photo ma jaya i dhime dhime mug no area moto chato jaya now it's like a safari area right so, so all you have to do is now let's go to the next step anybody else has a question uh, I... I... can it be big knot could be because again jo tame રાઈટ ટાઈમ ટ્રીટમેન્ટ ના કર્યું હોય તો પછી ધીમે ધીમે જે નોટ નો એરિયા છે ને એક્સપાન્ડ થતો જાય બાજુના જે મસલ હોય ને એ જોઈન્ટ થઈ જાય એમાં અને બીકમ્સ અ બિગર વન પર બીકોઝ આઈ હેડ લાઈક આઈ ટોલ્ડ યુ આઈ હેડ એક્સિડન્ટ 20 ઇયર્સ એગો એન્ડ આઈ હેડ અ પ્રોબ્લેમ એન્ડ લુક્સ લાઈક વેન આઈ વેન્ટ ટુ ધ ડોક્ટર હી સેડ ધ વેલ નાઉ ઓલરેડી એની ઉપર બીજો લેયર આવી ગયું છે ને સો ઇટ્સ નોટ ટ્રીટેબલ બટ પણ અગેન યુ કેન ટ્રાય એક્સરસાઈઝ રાઈટ એમ કેમકે ઇટ ડઝન હર્ટ રાઈટ પણ અગેન મારો અનુભવ છે જ્યારે એક પ્રોબ્લેમ હોય તમે એક પ્રોબ્લેમને સોલ્વ ન કરો તો એની ચેન ઊભી થાય બીજા પ્રોબ્લેમ એ તે જોડે જોડે આવવા માંડે રાઈટ મતલબ સપોઝ કે તમને આ મસલનું હું કહું છું કે તમને અહીંયા પ્રોબ્લેમ છે ઇન્જરીનો પ્રોબ્લેમ રાઈટ યુ કેન નોટ સોલ્વ એટ ના દેટ ઇન્જરી મે ખોલ અનધર ટાઈપ મસલ તો એ જે મસલ નીચેનો હોય રાઈટ ઓકે તમે જ્યારે મસલ ને વન્સ યુ સ્ટાર્ટ વન્સ યુ સ્ટાર્ટ યુઝિંગ ઇટ ઇટ ક્રિએટ્સ મોર પ્રોબ્લેમ યુ હેવ ટુ યુઝ યોર મસલ એન્ડ તમે કો ના મને પેઇન છે હું મારો રાઈટ હેન્ડ કો જે હું બો નહીં કરું ના આઈ હેવ અ પેઇન આઈ કેન નોટ રાઈટ સો ધેટ સિચ્યુએશન ક્રિએટ્સ મોર પ્રોબ્લેમ ટુ ધ અધર મસલ એન્ડ એટલે હું કહું છું કે તમે બીજા મસલ જ મળશે ઓકે ઇન્જરી વિલ ઇઝ ડિફરન્ટ થિંગ ધેન let's say okay, overuse of a muscle right chronic pain injury is totally different but my point is again injury may cause another chronic pain down the road right so we can at least avoid that part anybody else any question before we go to the next step feel free this is your chance gujarati english gamme the okay so અમિત ભાઈ હતા રાઈટ પેલા તો લેટ્સ યુઝ ડે ઓર પેન્સિલ રબર બેન્ડ રાઈટ જસ્ટ મેક શ્યોર યુ ડોન્ટ હર્ટ યોર નેક મસલ રાઈટ ડોન્ટ પ્રેસ ટુ મચ નાઉ લેટ્સ સે યુ ફાઇન્ડ ઇટ આઈ નો આઈ હેવ ફાઉન્ડ માઇન રાઈટ સો આઈ હેવ અ કપલ એવરીબડી હેઝ યુ નો હુએવર હેઝ અ ફ્રોઝન શોલ્ડર પ્રોબ્લેમ ધે ઓલવેઝ હેવ અ સમથિંગ ઇન ધ નેક બિલીવ મી યુ જસ્ટ નોટ એબલ ટુ ફાઇન્ડ ઇટ નાઉ આઈ યુઝઅલી યુઝ ધીસ ઓઇલ વેન આઈ ટેક અ શાવર and to supply it to find it and then you know try to break it and then wait for the next day when i take a shower that's all i do and i'm 80% recover i'm recover i mean so let's do the now you found a problem you say right and you know this this angle i'm good but when i turn on this angle i have a problem so that basically that's where you know the the muscle um maybe pops out or maybe it just comes up on the upper layer right but anyway so when you have a maximum pain in that angle you can go up and down you can go this way this way right wherever you have maximum pain and then let's say you found half inch size of the tight muscle right then you start breaking it so breaking some of that video ma joyo hoy so muscle na let the fiber arm hoy so you can do both way you can also rub this way or you can also rub this way right but be gentle this problem is been there for long you don't want to solve in a one day in one hour right so you just have to repeat this process over the period the blood circulation chain it chal thi jase the tight muscle chain muscle So what I'm doing now is basically showing you any angle, right? 
you can try. And you can also shift like four or five mm. So once you found, let's say, you, know, you press here, and then you press, you know, adjacent side, right? Little bit on the side, little bit on the side. So you cover uh, pretty much uh, half of each side. And the pachi, again, every time when you press it, you press only 20 seconds. 20 seconds is a rule. Uh, if you press more, you may have a problem. Kal pachi masala al right? And then you don't want to have a sore muscle tomorrow. So just try again. This problem has been there for long. You don't want to resolve it in one day, but at least you want to find it today. Right? You press and you can move on. Press 20 seconds, move on. 20 seconds, move on. Right? Now you change the side again, move on. Right? You can try couple times a day uh, initially, but I do only once a day now uh, because mine is 80% resolved. Any question before we move on? Okay. So basically, okay. that, this is this is this exercise is good if for the normal wear and tear, that the resulted from the normal wear and tear, not from the accident, because that could be totally a different situation. Yeah, I mean, this is only the chronic pain to you, right? Overuse of a muscle, right? There was to damage joy by accident. It's not easy. I mean, maybe operation or other treatment is needed, right? But again. Problem problem problem. Like at least you can treat that secondary problem. Yeah. If if there is a, a trigger point there or tight muscle there, right? That the muscle may use also that's where it creates the problem. Actually, muscle won't do so. Paisa the muscle muscle stays healthy. Okay, so the next one is treating the upper shoulder uh, over here, right? You can use your finger for a nap, but I don't think any one of us has a you know a strong finger that you can press and then you know, fix the problem, right? So for this, again, use of oil, it just helps you to easily locate the trigger point or the tight muscle. Is nothing. I'm bare hand, bare hand corona, so it, it takes a while to figure it out. So, the jare oil lagaro and a press with the medium pressure, right? And then you know you're gonna start realizing that, oh, hmm, I have something there, right? And then you go dig in, right? If it's a bigger, well, you treat you know, whole thing. Um, Magna down now it's a board wall, board now it's a good, so far you are, right? But either way, you need to start treating them, right? Uh, I have a, if it's a bigger uh, the knot, wait for the next step. Uh, hopefully that'll help you to find it and then treat it. Uh, so the next one is the upper shoulder. Um, personally, again, problem with the is a automatic chain time. So energy problem, why? So there are ways to find it. Again, oil use color. Um, none more to pencil in this color, right? but I'm gonna I'm gonna jump on to the next slide as well, uh, which is the use of a ball. I told you guys to kind of have a tennis ball, right? And uh, let me ask the audience: anybody has used the ball um, to have a massage? Anybody has used ball? Okay, well, I see one hand. Um, Maybe not, just the one or two, right? Okay, so uh, it's very easy. Um, it's my favorite tool uh, because it covers a lot of area. Uh, if you have a bigger knot, uh, you know, this will hopefully help. Um, I'm gonna show you uh, how I'm doing it on the, on the wall, okay? You need a wall. First you can see it, and then uh, you can try on your own. Uh, I'll give you like 60, um, 90 seconds to try on your own. But let me know if you can see. Can you see me? Uh, 
No, can you see me? Hello? I think not. Yeah, yes, we were able to see. Okay, so I'm, okay, you can see me now, right? Yes. You can see the ball, okay. All right, so let's say that you know you have a, a tight muscle here, okay? So I'm just gonna put the ball against the, the flat wall, right? Uh, if you have a cat shell, that actually helps the you know, ball with grip right from that, right? Yeah. Um, okay, so now all I'm doing is just rubbing around, putting you know the pressure this way. So I'm applying the pressure this way. So ball each and every there, right? And now I'm trying to find my, you know, pain area, right? Okay, so let's say that I found it here. Okay, so I'm gonna position that. Okay, so let's say I found it here, right? Then all I'm doing is me applying the pressure towards the wall and then also rubbing it this way, right? So it depends upon where you have a pain, you can rub it like, you know, horizontally, vertically, right? Or in a circle, whichever thing that helps you, right? Jenny, Vodare, are you, I'm going to use color over it. Take idea here. If a gym can use color, the ball is pretty good. So I just read that tip that I'm passing to you. Ball is dark to the ladies in the canty road there. And you must have a knock it over, right? And you can just, you know, screw up there, you know, and the ball will be positioned here and there. And the time I'm going to go away, the time I'm going to go away, let me do the exercise, come here, do rub curl, but what have you come to me? You can use the ball all the way here too, right? So, what can you do? Come on, spouse, the camera, and then you the bite also. And they'll probably help you for 30 seconds, and then they'll tire because too tired, okay? First, they're not able to find the exact spot where you have a problem. They will not able to trace enough. Oh, yeah, now I feel good, right? Now you need help. And then don't blame them. I mean, it's, it's a hard, right? Finding the spot, applying the pressure, and repeating that. Use a ball, right? And then it's very easy. If you try on your own, you'll figure it out. Yeah, they are ball for it. You say, Nichi, but that's okay. I mean, you can easily find, and then you break that, right? So again, I'm just trying, right? Applying the pressure. Do you want to try now? Sir, but I, yeah. I know it, it, it's your show, but what I do, I take a lacrosse ball, um, this kind of lacrosse ball, which is pretty heavier than a uh, tennis ball, you can see. And what I do is I put it in the socks. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And then I take it over here on the wall so it doesn't fall. And then of course, you, you rub it with, with the maximum pressure, but then I also do some active release by you know raising my hand and see which way I move that hurts. Like for example, in, in my case, it hurts over here. So in, in this motion, so I just, I put a pressure and I, I move my motion like this with, for the active re release. Right, so two things that you mentioned. One is uh, you can, again, using the ball one time is easy, but you have to use this, you know, for who knows how many weeks and months, right? So put that in the socks, or you can even have some mechanism to just have a ball hanging across the wall, right? And then second, what he mentioned is the position. Now the kid here, from the neck right? Yeah, she do join to name doctor from the dam to the other to care, right? Do the same thing for the ball too. I mean, you you are the patient and you need to pay close attention at which angle, how much pressure, pop. Everything is you and the ball, right? So do you want to try? Have you tried? Do you want to try? Or
if you are patient you have to try it try karyo mane kai na dukhyo khal aya aya karu na khambe what aya bezi ge aya pain tha baaki ab akha wah ham bezi me try kare diwa lagal ke du kai pain na thi pa aya upar na bhage dabao ne to thoru pain tha right so that means you know that's a good point uh, ramesh bhai ke tumhe jara dabao ne to jump sorry i forgot to mention that earlier રબ ક્યાં કરવાનું છે જ્યાં પેઇન થાય ત્યાં જ્યાં પેઇન નથી થતું ને ધેટ હેલ્ધી આ મીન તમને તરત ખબર પડી જશે હા હા ઇટ ઇઝ નોટ હેલ્ધી રાઈટ હા તમને જર દુખતું હોય ક્યાં રાઈટ તમે એમ કહો તમાર સ્પાઉ છે એ દબાવો ને તમે આમ જર દબાવો ને તો હા સો ફીલિંગ ગુડ રાઈટ તો ઇફ ઇટ યુ ઇફ યુ હેવ ફીલિંગ ગુડ ધેટ ધ રાઈટ સ્પાઉ ઇફ યુ આર નોટ ફીલિંગ ગુડ એટ ઓલ વેલ ધેટ ઇઝ નોટ ધ સ્પાઉ રાઈટ સો થેન્ક યુ રમન ભાઈ ફોર ધ ટેન્શન so you have to try right where you have a maximum good feeling pain right so if you don't have it in the let's say shoulder blade that's good for you i mean you don't have a problem there probably right and but the one neck much right so now it's hard to use a ball for the neck okay support her corner now right so i have a, another thing uh, but i'm just going to wait if anybody is trying then it's okay otherwise we can move on i see a couple of people are trying on the wall so by neck matte main bijay aur try kar raha tha wo tumne batao jinna you will have to move that uh... so i took a two lacrosse ball now okay i took a two lacrosse ball and put it in socks so now it create a pinat right so now i i'm tie the socks and then i take a yoga block and i lay down on the floor put it under my neck like this i i i oh, okay. i hope everybody can see put it under my neck like this move the camera a little bit okay a little bit up can you see it? yeah it just has okay. the camera and then then i try to move my neck either way which way and see where it hurts Yeah. and then i i i move back and forth it, however uh, we, we, no, we tilt the camera up we cannot see tilt the camera up little bit yeah little bit up yes good good, good good that's good okay so now i have this two lacrosse ball on both side of my neck right and then i i i push either way where it hurts and then i i, I move my neck and see where it hurts whether i i nod it hurts or i say no when it hurts and that's when i do the pressure Right. And, so, you, and you are right. You should not do more than twenty seconds. Yeah. So he made a couple of points, and I want to summarize that. Okay. So I don't have a song. So just pretend this is another ball. Okay. So everybody's neck size is different, right? So and pain point is different too. Uh, so put these two ball in the song, and then have a knot, right? So. basically you you create your own mechanism so you can apply here right or here or here right and then you use a soft to no gaat mar do mar right it lagu pasu thai ne you can have a gaat on the base base side right suppose ke um a soft chamano so you have a one knot here uh, one gaat here one gaat here one ball here and one here right you got my point so that's our position ball in same ray right now use your own body now and then you can you come in floor upar sui jao right make sure my recommendation um ab jo jo pressure nahi activity cha na don't do on a carpet carpet mein wrinkle thai jase mar bota mein thai gaya hai right and let don't do on a carpet do it on a hard floor right so then you apply the pressure on your own again same technique jo ball paache karwano hai ne so one ball is enough neck upar karwano hai so you can use a two ball with the socks make sense you have to try i mean otherwise you know this problem is going to continue okay so any questions before we move on to the next one
दुखवा मे तो आ थोड़ी दबाव ने तो मैं बहुज राहत रहे ઇન્વેસ્ટમેન્ટ યપ 
it's only $30. You know, when you make a one trip to your therapist, it costs more, right? So it has a different knob here. You can see it. So I'm, I'm kind of zooming yeah. in, right? What and, it called? What it called? Yeah, so they have a multiple version. Um, okay. 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 It costs about a $30 on Amazon. પ્લાસ્ટિકુ <laughs> So if you want to press here, right? And you just apply, right? And then with the one, one hand, you can do this by watching a TV, anything you can do, right? In parallel, you can use your computer too, right? But it's to the point, and how do you apply the pressure? Uh, with your other hand, you just press this. And that's all, you have two free hands and massage is going on. Anyone who has this type of a muscle problem by this believe me this will you know save sometimes your time right again this is not going to resolve all of your problem but this will help you to press your trigger point right i mean there are pressing right and then you can use this right now right you can rub it right so from it but i'm not like there okay have it in a nap right yeah you can do it in a nap too right but if you have a smaller problem then you can use this right if you have a bigger problem you can use this you can have a bigger problem than this you can use a ball and if you have bigger you can use two ball right and the next one is if you have a whole back burning right then you can use this so i'm going to show you this as a map but before i go on a back body any question okay um and i have a link so i'll i'll share my presentation with you right so you can you know if you interested you can buy it from the amazon again they have a multiple version um they have a two piece version too i don't recommend okay tumhe mere review mein aa chalu che ke when you have a two piece here there's a little screw here right and it helps you uh in case tumhare you know big man na tu hoy right towel ka towel so yeah it's like two piece so it's easy to to think if you so pachi do ta it's from pressure karwa ja ne so i think kaise kaise nikal gaya hai kaise tuti gaya hai um you can buy a smaller one if you are traveling uh, but don't buy with the two parts i just buy with the one part you know that will help you okay so next one is oh, okay some reason i'm not able to minimize okay all right so the next one is now you have a bigger problem as i mentioned then what do you do um well you use the form rule right um let me ask the question um how many of you have used the form rule this is not a sponge okay this is a palm right? you cannot press it right so it's, it's not solid Uh, either so it's a little bit compressed right how many of you have used this any any hand one two no nope. i don't see any i see you know uh, one person showing you good uh so do you want to um, at least share your experience um benu naam nahi khabar hona jai sri ben that's the when you you want to say something about how you use it or how you feel actually hu nahi use karti hatu amnu joyu ne etle hu lai aavi par maro son use kare chhe okay so i'll show you anybody else i i use this roller for multiple pur pur purpose okay for the for the back uh i use this uh, uh, <laughs> Yeah. 
yeah, yeah, I can see you. I can see okay, you. Can but you see my yeah, yeah, but because I unmute. Okay. So, so the technique is that when you number one, you don't you don't bring your roller below your mid waist. I mean mid back. Okay, and then you you bring your elbows closer. So now your your back is rolled, and then you you roll your body back and forth. Okay, that's for the back. But I use that, you know, after my surgery, I use that for my thighs to relax my muscles so I can bend and straighten my leg properly. And, and for that, I basically, I use this roller because my, my, my thigh muscles got a little, really stiff with the, with the surgery. So I use this to put my um, thigh muscles in and try to roll while I, I, I I, I raise my uh, ankles up, up uh, from the floor. So, so this is a this is a lot of functionality for the side of this. Also, you can you can you can roll like this for your um, uh, scapulas and the and the side side back you know side of your back. So that's what I use it mostly. Okay, uh, and that's the actual use actually. Uh, so, if you do weightlifting, um, they usually use this uh, as a post weightlifting. Um, next day, you know, they're going to have a sore muscle. And then, another thing that they're going to do is that when you tight muscle, it's you know, big. You cannot you know, use this to treat that you know, tight muscle band, right? So, in a matter of and it goes with your own pressure. Just like, you know, um, you just apply the downward pressure for I'm going to give you one advice. Don't use this on a carpet unless you have that, you know, flat carpet. Because um, pressure on it, you can get a form and it mess up. I had to, you know, call the, the guy and fix the carpet, right? So that's my personal advice. But um, you just apply the downward pressure and then roll it. Right. And yeah. It just, you know, you're going to get the amazing pressure. And if you twist your position, figure out you know, where you have a maximum pain, you can apply it. Right? But that it was you. You don't apply this you know, pressure technique anywhere, only where you have, where you think could be a tight muscle or muscle mass. Any question? Again, you know, rule is 20 seconds. Every muscle with a pressure technician, don't go over 20 seconds, maybe 30 at the max, right? No, they're gonna overreact and you're gonna have, you know, sore muscle next day. Uh, anyway, so may I, some of you doing this first time today, right? You're gonna have a problem. You're gonna have a sore muscle tomorrow or maybe in a couple of days, right? But don't worry. You know, that's normal. Even if you massage your massage, you have a sore muscle. If you're not doing, you know, regularly, then you're gonna have a problem. So muscle means tendency, when you press them, they're gonna react. But yeah, you continuously you know, do that. And then you'll have that in a habit. Any question? Uh, before I move on to the next on this part, just on a form roll or any other previous discussion. Ashok Bhai, I have a bijou chen in my pass. I am a bubble jew chen. Can you see that? Yeah, that's also good. Uh, bubble, any anyone you can find, right? Uh, bubble no one, it's just uh, tractor track to the jew chen. Right? And that's also good muscle and you know portion of the muscle press It also like the blood circulation energetic room muscle press like every other inch or inch and a half, right? roll eventually you cover the entire muscle. 
એટલે આ જયારે હાથમાં ખાલી ચડી જાય ને ત્યારે આમ આમ કરીએ છીએ ને તો ખાલી ઉતરી જાય આ બબલ ને લીધે થતું હોય કે ગમે તે ખાલી <laughs> So this is something different. Um, it's my personal experience. Okay, I will do trigger point. I will do my try. Okay, and still I have a pain. And I'm talking really pain chest. So what could be next? I scratch my neck and find you know the the magna dana that he got on resolve that. and next day when i start working on a computer well within the few hours problem pass us okay. so ek video mein jo to unfortunately i don't have that video handy um par am ke she ke your problem is my problem could be not at the higher level of the muscle it could be the inner muscle so એક બીજો કે ત્રીજો વિડીયો આપણે જોયો ને એમાં બે બોન્ડ બતાવેલા અને એની સાથે મસલ બતા તો માય પ્રોબ્લેમ મે બી એટ ધ બોન્ડ લેવલ અગેન બોન્ડ ને તે મસલ તો જોઈએ ભાઈ અને ધ કુડ બી એ યુ નો ઓવર યુઝ ઓફ અ મસલ સિચ્યુએશન देयर એન્ડ કુડ બી એ યુ નો એ ટાઈપ મસલ देयर રાઈટ સો હાઉ ડુ યુ રીચ ધેટ ઓલ ધ બોન્ડ બોન્ડ લેવલ મસલ માં if you can you cannot press anything right so that just you have to use some sort of a stretching technique and that's what i'm going to show you next and uh, maybe you know it, it may help you and it's nothing wrong i mean you know you can't lose anything by doing this extra stretching so i'm going to show you that <coughs> <coughs> so first um but you can put me on a spark now Let me know if you can see the floor. And you can follow along with me. Uh, so first, just see me, okay? And then um, we'll have a like, follow along exercise. Can, so, can okay. some, someone unmute and confirm? You can see the Ashok Bhai in a big screen. No. Uh, 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 I can see. Okay, that means your local setting, you might need to put on a speaker view or you need to put something because I've already uh, put focus on, on his screen. I cannot see. Okay, uh, are we ready? It's a couple of years, so we can stop. Okay, sorry, I cannot see the screen, but... Uh, yes, we are ready. All right, so the first thing is, um, again, you can just... see me right don't do anything okay sit in a vajrasan we were always say you know vajrasan so sit on a vajrasan right now i'm just going to start with my left hand first okay so make a face just want to confirm you can see the floor right my hand yes yes okay cool so put that in the hand in the middle of the two leg right now just see that you have a you know a okay my your elbow here right and then you have your uh, left shoulder and then you have your right shoulder so what are we doing here is we're going to stretch this shoulder and make a straight line this this and this three four okay so again just watch me okay so now i'm making a fist here so i have like more strength right I'm making a fist here too and then put this hand on the back right now i just put this on a little bit on the left right so i have a little room here so now i'm going to breathe in and then i'll have a stretch so you just watch me so i'm going to stretch 
So what I'm doing is, you know, I'm looking at the ceiling all the way. So try to position my uh, elbow, the shoulder, left shoulder, and the right shoulder in one line. You cannot do a one line. That's okay, right? And you don't have, you have to be gentle to your muscle, right? I have a problem. That's why I can't do one line, right? So, but you can just keep trying, right? So again, I'm going to show you again. Breathe in. Try to see on the top and the ceiling, right? And then breathe out. And then breathe in again, and then breathe out. We do this one for 15 times, and then we you know, switch the hand. So let's do it together. So if you can ask me, then I can say information. All right, question. Do you do you put pressure on the on the hand which is in the floor? Do you put any any pressure on that? Can you no. Do that? no pressure. It's just just holding there. Yeah, it's just a support. Yeah. I mean, you know, when some shoulder no much or a little nature of pressure away, but we don't need to apply. So goal goal switch everybody can you stretch this part. Yeah. Entire. Gene problem chan and a feel per se problem. And all we're doing is just stretching this entire muscle. Right? I mean, again, little by little this and then a ball. And then the other stuff. Now we now we doing like a yoga type of an entire upper shoulder stretching in general, right? Uh, so good. Yeah. Uh, are you bending right arm behind the back of the body, or are you keeping it straight? Bending. So yeah. like, can you show us from the back side? Okay. Okay. I so Thank you. Too. Okay. So just watch. My elbow, my both shoulder, okay? Fist here, fist here, right? Breathe in. I'll do it here too now. So you don't need to stay. It's just stretch. Stay for like two seconds, right? Pachi 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 don't again be gentle. Uh, it's your own muscle. You don't want to break it. But routinely, Karsone, so Tamane, I just say, and a more personal experience, Agare Pachi, I would say my 90% J reputation problem, Tata in the diet. So I have a two step, one is this, second one is the next one. So I want you to try at least. So I don't have it. I don't have a pictures or anything. Okay, so you just have to practice now. If you have a question, you can let me know now. Or if you have a question, you can ask during the you know, end of the yoga session, right? So I can show you example again. But if you don't try now, then you're not going to have a correct or sure correct strategy. You just have to. Try it. Feel good. Thai. Maza aave. Yeah. Okay. Maza. <laughs> I mean, I mean we are talking this entire thing, right? Not just the one little area. Uh, forget the finding the trigger point. Right. So you need to do the combination of pretty much all. Uh, so Ashok, by you do fifteen times on one side continuous, and then fifteen times on another side. Right. Okay. And if possible, do it three times a day, right? Initially, you can reduce once you feel better. But the review that I have seen for this particular exercise. Can, can you do something for? Uh, you have, cannot go in Vajrasana without Vajrasana. Cannot sit in Vajrasana. 
You cannot see no Vajrasan? Yeah, because of the knee surgery. No, but then you can just try like that. Vajrasan oh. makes it easy, right? But Okay. Yeah, how about on the knee? If I stand on the knee? Me? Like this? Yeah, that works too. Go that will work. Yeah, that Ushavan, that works too. The goal oh. is to Ajabaksana Akko. Akko Kheti Nam Karwasi. And the Jake in your Kanash Mart and the Jake in one about two columns or it's half a catch all that. But so make no problem, Chen. Make no issue. Neck also is a problem. So long as you try to lose your passion, I would say. You know, don't break anything. Uh, you can do slowly, be gentle to your muscles. Okay. So, this is a month ago, right? So, I cannot bend my knee or uh, sit on a vajrasan. So, I, I try to improvise what you just taught us. Like, you know, try to hold like this. Use the stool. Does that, does that work? That works too. But once you start, you know, sitting in a vajrasan, you will see a totally different pressure, different stretch, right? At your position, you cannot escape, or your your stiff, let's say, shoulder cannot escape from uh, stretching. Mm -hmm. I mean, automatic put to catch our minds here. But you have a better better arm, you have a certain limit, you cannot go further, right? Again, if you have, if your health, not allows you to do a certain position, that's fine, whatever you can do. I mean, yeah. you know, rather nothing, doing nothing, you know, do something, right? But this entire thing, you know, it's gonna stretch, believe me. Okay, so any other questions on the position wise? Again, you know, I don't have a video or anything, right? So you just have to make sure that you're doing the correct, right? If you have a question, you can ask now, or you can ask, Whenever we I think we will we will do it tomorrow during yoga session. Right. I think Bakul Bhai uh yeah, we'll we'll do it tomorrow. Yeah, this one helps because Aparat Baddai, we overuse a phone, computer, right? So stretching this area is definitely a good idea. Okay. I'm gonna move on next. How are we doing with the time? Um, it's almost six. Almost, oh boy. Okay, so I'm gonna move on to the next one, which is align rib and back muscle joints. Again, I read this, uh, whoever had a problem at the um, bone level, um, this one helps me too. So I'm gonna demonstrate first. This is easy, you know, uh, it's somewhat same, but I'm just going in a different steps now. So let's say a fellow tiger position, Mahavi Joel, right on. Uh, okay, I'm gonna show it here, right? And then you stretch your hand. I don't have space, okay. So then you do a one hand, breathe in, breathe out. You do leg, breathe in, breathe out. Again, you do the other leg, breathe in, breathe out. You do this hand, breathe in, breathe out. So what happens is basically when you raise your hand, JK muscles right, the automatic align time over the period. Right? You do the leg, so that might be problem why so it helps to align, right? Again, I'm talking at the rib level, right? At the bone level. That's where you know the, the fat goes, right? So I think it's easy for everybody to follow, right? You do it about, let's say, um, this one cycle, you do it about 10 to 12 times, right? And then I have a variation. So the variation is basically, you do one hand and one leg together. So right hand and then left leg together, right? You try to align, right? Uh, like, you know, one straight line, right? And then you do it with the other hand and leg. Again, breathe in, breathe out while you do it, right? So whoever is doing it, they're gonna feel the stretch on the back, right? And they may start feeling good too, believe me.
Okay. Any question on this? Yeah, I'm almost at the time. I'm trying to wrap up, but I'm not going to rush because of you know, we're running out of the time. Any question? It looks straightforward. I have a, a little bit of instructions too. Okay. So then acupressure way. So again, acupressure works differently than to the point, finding the trigger point, massage it, and then have a full body stretch. But, you know, hey, Bhagwan, no, Jeremy session attend Karuna, Kare, Elokoyoku, Kaya, Bhagma, yeah, as I say, right? You can press here, and that generally uh, helps uh, shoulder pain. I, I'm just showing you here. Um, I personally don't have any experience um, doing this, but I thought at least Jekoine acupressure, acupressure, any technique of now you are, so they can try these two. So ongoing care. So first is, well, what is the food for muscle? It's protein. We being Gujarati, Indian, we don't eat too much protein, or we don't eat even enough protein, right? So does anybody know what is the, the daily need of a protein for an adult? 60 grams. We don't eat, right? Hardly we eat. So again, 40 hoodies of one banana sugar can you roll on nicely, no problem. 40 kudis have problems outside. Well, pay attention on your protein needs. If you don't eat protein, you're not gonna have a healthy muscle. So my advice, you know, eat protein uh, on a regular basis if possible. Second, blood circulation. Sitting in an office chair or you know, doing the minimum walking, that's not gonna help. I have a blood circulation problem. Use curry to blood circulate somewhere, right? Abruja heart chair, again, sit there and see or who they chale, pump curry, right? Cody would eat a pump, pick them first class chale. Cody Pachi suit, I cover it, pump to Kadaji or no, you have a pump nazi and muscles chair, they lose tie. Heart nourish. It blocks our channel. The blood supply is the destination all the way. Right? You start having a muscle issues. Eventually, that's because if you don't have enough blood circulation. Now, force the blood never out and not quite repairable. But we don't do that. Right? And focus on the blood circulation too. That'll help you. You can have a fast walking, cycling. Cardio type na yoga karavashi, right? That's what we need to. Yoga definitely helps on the stretching part, right? Yoga is not going to do enough forceful blood circulation unless you do a heavy breathing type of exercise, right? Location, you would have to go tight, right? And when you do a lot of work, you don't have to Believe me, you pay attention to the blood circulation. Stretching, uh, thanks Bakulwai for your initiative. It, it's really you know, helping all of us to stay healthy and then fully stretched. Uh, avoid acute and or chronic muscle overload. Uh, if you're using on a computer, give a break. Uh, give a break to yourself. Um, any other repetitive works that you're doing, uh, give a break, you know, take a break every hour or something, right? Even for your eyes too. You're constantly watching a one thing, you know, for a long, that's not a good idea, right? So have a break everywhere that, you know, you have a continuous work. Uh, limit use of a phone. I mean, WhatsApp is killing our neck, right? So you can't just, you know, keep watching here, right? So have a one day off for your phone or something. Uh, but yeah, uh, my wife, she's kind of said, hey, I don't use WhatsApp, okay? I don't have WhatsApp, guys, right? Uh, sleeping position. So this one also helps me. Um, in my last three, four months problem that I suffer, right? So sleeping position, yeah, who knows, you know, what type of a pillow you have, right? Um, and pachi exercise karalu right? 
pay attention. I mean, again, I'm not an expert on the slipping side, but I'm just pointing out that all of these combinations creates an unhealthy body in, in general, right? Uh, and then last but not least, have a patience. It took a year, as I say, to have all kinds of problems and don't expect that, you know, you can fix it, right? Uh, easily. So, I mean, have patience in short, right? Um, and I have a, that, you know, um, the form roller copied over from the uh, previous slide. So I'm just going to spend a couple of minutes to talk about my problem. Um, I, had, I had a healthy body until like 2010. And then I got into um, this muscle knot. And the one day, like 2012 time frame, I could not work. I, I was just typing like that, okay? Moving a hand like that was already painful. So I kind of lowered down my table and everything. And then I got into the massage. And I figured out that about, you know, when they go into my neck, at that time, it was helping me relieve my pain. And I did the research, and at that time, I read this book to, to figure out that, hey, this is actually, you know, a trigger point issue, right? And then it worked, it resolved until March this year. Once I stopped going into the office and, you know, started working remote for crazy hours, um, by May time frame, again, I could not lift pretty much anything with my right hand. Let's say blue do the nukean, right? No, I cannot lift. Um, and all of this blood circulation stopped because of the overuse of muscle because of the work. Um, and eventually, Bakulbai started this yoga. I mean, I jumped on right away. It helped me. But still, after even about two months, I was not able to lift the milk can with my one hand, right? This hand I can lift, you know, two, but with this, now one. And then um, we started this, uh, the Jai, um, the Jai Bhagwan? Jai Bhagwan. Jai Bhagwan, right? And then, then he started talking about the acupressure. And then it struck me that, hey, over the period, I forgot about the trigger point knowledge that I had. And I started applying it. And then immediately I got the knots and resolved and eventually, you know, all of this. Now my focus is, you know, just having this, um, go Mukasan, right? Do it perfectly on the both sides. And I think I can do it in a month. Uh, I also did the research that, you know, which muscles are being used when you do like that, right? And then um, I started working on that muscle. I used the ball to kind of you know, apply the pressure uh, and then rub it right against the wall. And then even, you know, in this week alone, I see a lot of difference myself uh, doing this. Um, so I thought, you know, um, hopefully my story will motivate you and um, start paying attention to your own body and even help others. Any questions or any anything that you want to, you know, share your experience? I know we are out of time now, but uh, still valuable if you want to say something. So, Ashok bhai, Gau Mukhasan baate, mara jamra aapko problem si, okay? Pela pela ice skating kata fake chasel. So, bathroom ma naata hoy ne, sabu dey ne, labdu pelu thi jay, right? Pachi am rub karwa na vidya ma. Ane am hath lay jawa no, ane pachi aath kisi ne? I am told to do pressure up. I am going to do a movement. 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 I am Okay. I have a question. What's the difference between knots and scar tissue? Scar tissue, right? So, are you talking about scar from injury or? Scar from the surgery. They said that inside the, you know, when they do the surgery, they cut the muscles, right? Oh, oh I see your point. The scar tissue underneath, 
which prevents you from mobility of the joint. So how do you get rid of the scar tissue without pain? It's painful to remove it. You know, with your, you know, somebody told me that you can use this on your uh, joint to, to remove the scar tissue, but it's really painful when, when you do that. Yeah. So, really easy to do it. so I had a, a surgery long ago. Um, uh, it's like about a 16 inch long scar I have, 16 huh? inch, right? And I had the same same feeling that, hey, you know, what's gonna happen? Oh, they had like big cut, right? They removed half of my lung long ago. And said, um, how am I gonna kind of get back, right? Now I'm gonna be able to stretch my hand, so which was this, right? So believe me, this one, this hand was best actually right now compared to wow. this. So for doctor, they just resolve by itself. It's over the period, but you still need to do routine, you know, exercise therapy, right? Don't be lazy, believe me. If you become lazy and not doing certain things, eventually, you know, not will start building up, right? Two ways you can damage the muscle. One is the overuse, and second is not using it. So use it normally, right? And just don't think that, hey, I have a problem. I'm not gonna, you know, work on this hand now, right? This hand is no longer used. No, don't do that. I mean, if you have a problem, you just have to work on it, fix it, find it, research it, right? Whatever you can do. Right? Helps? Yes, okay. thank you. Yeah. Anything so, else? Yeah. Yeah, I want to share my experience. Uh, but before I share my experience, I want to thank you a lot uh, for uh, sharing your research. I think you have done a, quite a lot of research. And thanks for sharing with us. It was really, really helpful. Um, I had a frozen shoulder problem. So doctor diagnosed as a frozen shoulder problem late last year. And I was diagnosed type two diabetes like mid last year. So I want to just advise like if you have some sort of a frozen shoulder, doctor told me that, you know, usually diabetic patients are more susceptible to catch a frozen shoulder. So maybe check that. Uh, the other thing I would like to uh, stress is, so late last year, I had a frozen shoulder problem. I was not able to like, you know, lift a like, cup of tea like that. I can lift like this, but like with a straight hand, I can't because the, like, you know, too much stress on the muscles on the upper arm. And I was fortunate, actually, I would say like, thanks to Corona that we were able to join uh, yoga classes. Not only Bakulbai, but there is a Radhani Mandir yoga classes. So we do twice a twice a week. And I think the, my my experience is we do a sukshma vyaya in the beginning, like you know, warming up the upper body. Uh, usually, just like you know, this kind of stuff, this kind of stuff, and like this. That I I do daily, like you know, just spend like five ten minutes and just do like upper body exercise. And you won't believe that I took almost six to seven physiotherapist appointment. That didn't help me, but this like Sukhsma Vyayam, that helped me a lot. And I think you put it very, very correctly that, you know, muscles are not like money that it's like, it's like if you don't use it, then yeah, you're going to lose the flexibility. It's going to become more and more tight, more and more st stiff. So I think this exercise, I think it's it's making like, you know, all the muscles very, very uh, not tight. They loosen. And I think it, it helped me a lot. So I wanted to share that experience. No, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And you're right. So when you have a problem, yeah, I cannot lift this way, but I can lift this way, right? That happens. And again, you know, a particular muscle is having a trouble, right? And you made a good point that, yeah, I mean, you can treat a specific area where you have a pain, but in general, have a stretching for your entire body. So if something is cooking slowly, you know, you can resolve that. And then going forward, just continuously do that. You know, as I mentioned, again, I'm not a doctor, but the way that, you know, I understand how the body works, put together that seven, six tips at the end of the presentation, do that, pay attention. Blood circulation seems simple, but has a lot of impact. Uh, anybody else? I think Bharat Bhai, Nanda Pra, you have an issue or not, Bhagat Nukai? You want to share anything? 
his doctor too. Okay, you're, you're still muted. Ashok Bhai, thank you very much for sharing your experiences and uh, frozen shoulder exercises. Hello? Yes, Bharat Bhai, we can hear you. Go ahead. Okay. I had a shoulder pain, right shoulder pain uh, before a couple of years. So, I mean, I had a problem to raise my uh, hand like this. So I went to the dog. When I visited India, they took my X-ray, and the uh, doctors, you know, I mean, asked, told me to do a calcification, calcium deposit in the muscles. So, but he didn't advise anything to do what kind of exercise. So it was short visit. Then I came here, and after a couple of years, the pain was same. So I went to the another orthopedic doctor here, and he took an X-ray, and he said same thing that you know, you have a calcification. And you can see an X-ray is white spot because calcium deposit. Then he told me to go to the uh, physiotherapist. I went one time and he showed me exercise. And then I started doing all exercise at home. Then I didn't go. Now I am, uh, I started exercise because of the exercise. I, I don't have any pain now. Just doing exercise and uh, your yoga. Yeah, I mean, you know, um, thank you for, for sharing that. Um, so I wanna tell, you know, a different message um, is um, sometimes, you know, doctor finds something, you get scared, and some other doctors, you know, kind of paisa banao, and you, oh, yeah, some of you know, surgery could be a to prepare for now, and you will feel that, yeah, you know, my problem is resolved. But every time when you do the surgery, it's a cut, it's something else, you know, have another problem, right? Blood didn't be given, and now you have a scar. What happens with this? blood circulation in that area, right? So first thing, my personal experience for, you know, eight years ago, um, uh, 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 orthopedic doctor passe, right? And I go, yeah, you have, it was a red skin or doctor also. And I go, yeah, you have a, you know, rotator cuff here and uh, insurance covers that. And I'll just cut that piece and, you know, you're gonna be, you know, back to your, your business. And I said, no, nah, I, I don't want to do that. Right? And with that single, like, I found that here and then resolved without anything until this year, again, I had a problem. But yeah, I, I, pay attention. I mean, you know, sometimes I think exercise resolves more problem. Uh, if it's a routine, I mean, accident is a different story, right? Uh, but yeah, I mean, believe in exercise and rather waiting to have a problem and then do the exercise. I'll do the exercise now every day so you don't deal with the problem. I want to tell you, share one thing. Fulbright. Yes. Okay. Uh, I want to share one experience. Yes, yes one me, me and my friend. Uh, my friend has a shoulder pain and he he went to the orthopedic doctor. The orthopedic doctor said, don't use a hand rest. You know, the chair rest by, while we driving the car or while we're working at a at a home, our office, we use a chair rest. So don't remove your chair rest, hand rest. So remove your hand rest, don't use hand rest. And then, I mean, it will help for the shoulder pain. Do you, you understand what I mean? The Tamim says that the chair is under the hand rest. You don't use it. You don't use it. You don't use it. You don't use it. The natural position shoulder ne hoy ne, the disturbed thi jai. Amate shoe jai ke shoulder no, je niche no bone hoy ne, the up jai. Itle ano ano je gap hoy ne, the ocho thi jai ne impingement syndrome ke. Itle itle je upper no je ab bone hoy ne bone, ano ano baat je upper na niche na upper na bone ne am touch tha. Itle friction tha, ano ano gap ocho thi jai. Ab bone che, ab humerus che, ab shoulder shoulder socket che, am ab bone am ab itna move thai. So he, am I gap or a gap to my shoulder chair hand rest use current at the upper pressure of current upper pressure at lap gap watch of the gen and then impingement syndrome and in a blue bonch and a rough thigh upper na bonsa always car drive caro work caro there 
હેન્ડ રેસ્ટ યુઝ જ નહીં કરવાનો હેન્ડ રેસ્ટ યુઝ કરતા બંધ થઈ ગયો છે ને 50% ચાર્જ કાર પેન ઘટી જશે અને મારો પણ એક્સપેન્સ છે મારા ફ્રેન્ડ નો પણ એક્સપેન્સ ગુડ થેન્ક યુ નેવર યુઝ નેવર યુઝ હેન્ડ રેસ્ટ આઈ હેવ ક્વેશ્ચન પર देयर ઇઝ અ देयर ઇઝ અનધર થિંગ ઇઝ ધેટ યુ હેંગ યોર સેલ્ફ વિથ ધ હેન્ડ ધેટ પુલ અપ બાર you know start with 10 seconds go up to 2 minutes you just hang there then yeah. the repeat yeah. syndrome will go away uh, and uh, your muscles will stretch automatically all of the muscles yep so put the bar on the door frame yes jantaben go ahead yeah uh, first thank you ashok bhai uh, for for your experience and your knowledge that you shared with us Uh, I have one small question. Like, uh, तमिल जेके पर बता भी यार uh, method है, like exercise के stretch के कई पर एक करिया पची ice pack use करवानो। तो good point. मुँह थोड़ी जिद्दी theory हो मानो जो के तमिल कई करो और पची over करो और तमिल painful situation में आओ और now you know you use ice pack, right? So to me limit yourself uh get to pressure up all right uh when you do the massage the first time when i did my first time massage you know long ago i could be my body up all 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 thai gyo man lage ke aa kota danda ma ho gyo right and but then it slowly help me my body had you know started adopting the pressure right uh but atyare je me je kai badu batayo ne um don't overdo you're not going to be able to resolve the problem in a week so start slow but if you have a, let's say chronic pain and as a result if you using um any ice pack or even a uh, hot pad right mm-hmm. then yeah, you can use it but on the long run uh, my wife uses hot pad every day uh, uh, but on the long run we don't want to live with the hot pad every day right I mean, yeah, temporarily it helps to feel good, but it's not a medicine. Medicine is something that you know we break it down and then resolve it. Tamna hard dukhe se, for example, yeah. you apply the hot pad uh, or cold pad, right? And mm-hmm. then yeah, it helps you, but it's not resolving. So think about resolving, right? Yeah. Next. Okay. ખ્યાલ your resolving your day worth of the problem right yeah. i mean yeah, that's what temporary you, solution yeah yeah you use every day you you find right you take a yeah. time on every day and you're going to be fine right and my theory is all different um based upon my long experience dealing with the situation i said problem solve kem na tha let's just start to find out let's do the research right but mm-hmm. so google ma mala right for karex hua hai ke darek ni situation along ho hai right એટલે આસ્ક યોર થેરાપી ઇફ યુ સ્ટીલ ગોઈંગ દેટ એ નો વોટ ડુ આઈ ડુ રાઈટ યા આઈ સ્પેક હાઉસ મી ફોર અ ડે રાઈટ બટ આઈ વોન્ટ રિઝોલ્વ ધીસ રાઈટ એન્ડ ઇફ દે કમ અપ વિથ એની સ્પેસિફિક સ્ટ્રેચ ફોર યુ રાઈટ એની એની પોઝિશન એ નો યુ ડુ ધીસ એન્ડ ધેટ એ હાઉસ બટ તમે હમણાં કીધું કે તમારો હાથ પાછળ નહીં જતો રાઈટ તો બીજો હાથ જાય છે રાઈટ તો ના યુ ડુ ધ કમ્પેરિઝન રાઈટ કે કેટલો જાય છે ક્યાં નથી જતો હોય સો મારી પાસે એક ફોટો છે મસલનો આ કમ્પ્યુટરમાં નથી પણ આઈ ટ્રાઈ ટુ ઇન્ક્લુઝ ધેટ મે કીધું ને કે કે આ કરવું છે રાઈટ તમારે યા જે યાન માટે નહીં થતું મારાથી એ નહીં થતું રાઈટ તો મારે નહીં થતું આ બાજુ રાઈટ યા સો નાઉ આઈ એમ વર્કિંગ ઓન ધેટ પાર્ટ સો એટ લીસ્ટ આઈ ફાઉન્ડ ધેટ વોટ મસલ્સ આર બીંગ યુઝ્ડ ફોર ધીસ અને એમાં જે રિવર્સ સાઈડના મસલ છે i'm going to work on that part right and you tumne aap jaran presentation when i share it i'll i'll include that slide yes, so sure. at least you know but i think the message that i wanted to send today 
was there are solutions available in the internet, right? You just have to use the right word on Google, right? And then, or even YouTube, um, find something. If it's not a right material, if it's not helping, go next, right? But always something is available. You and me are not the first person to have this problem. Other people have a problem too. So doctor has a lot of problems. Right, so let's you know, try to take advantage. And meanwhile, we continuously live that healthy lifestyle as I mentioned at the end, right? And then do whatever we can do the stretching part wise. Yeah. One day it's gonna click, believe me. No, yeah. I, I suffered my my first frozen shoulder issue from two thousand from nineteen ninety seven to two thousand twelve. Fifteen years I suffered, and then I found a problem. So you just have to kind of put, have that in the mind that uh uh I need to work on it. I don't want to use ice pad every day, right? Yeah. Or I don't want to use a hot pad every day. But I'll use it for a day, or a week, or a month, but not forever. So yeah. that will motivate you to find something that works for you, right? Yeah, sure. Thank you so much. Ashok, a frozen shoulder related exercise share kar bhi Ame par dada bhagwan uklu acupressure no seminar web seminar attend karyo to. And I found they showed like three exercise, but I found one exercise really useful because it's so simple. It's like you stand in the position, like stand like this, but I and then you like from the back you move your hand like this. It's like giving vibration. And what it does, it, it basically relaxes your entire arm muscles all the way to the shoulder. So it gives you like you do like this and take all the way up. Like do like this. Like Pala Apra Sankar Bhagwan do Damru Nathi or do it. Dugdugi Vagarta, if it's a check, Pachar delay, and a check Agarsuti Tamilija, and a Tamao Pache Koka Corona, I think I feel very relaxed muscle on my hand. Yeah, and a frozen shoulder, my boat helpful. Yeah, Amit by Mapon Epila, due to Dada Bogwanma, and a Bane Athe Epila. I'll correct it, no Dada Bogwan is Jay Bogwan. Sorry, sir. It's a different thing. But again, to me, it's a blood circulation, right? The mamam corona, they play actually poor throat of thigh, right? Yeah. Uh, but the maya to the Kali hand to put attention, right? Yeah. But yeah, that, that anything, I think, you know, again, blood circulation, protein, routine stretching, um, understanding it's your own muscle, just don't abuse them, right? You know, give them a break. Uh, that mentality is needed. Uh, sometimes, you know, we think that, yeah, what's that video is more important. No, it's not. It's important is your own body. Anybody else? I think uh, we're pretty much done, right? Yep. Wait, I have one thing. You know, I've suffered a frozen shoulder for many years, right? Yep. Yeah. All right. It was to point after we, we went over so many information, they were wonderful. But there's two points that we missed. I don't know if you can see me. Timat comes in here so I can show it to you. Okay. What I found that helped me the most were these two points. One is right in the shoulder, Mogulma, right between this muscle right here. See this right here? Yeah. If you push on it, it is a trigger point there that many people don't think about. That helps you move your arm back and forth a lot more. And there's also another trigger point right in the back right here. Okay? If you see it right here, you'll feel it. It'll, 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 it'll hurt you. That will also help you in moving your muscles. And when you touch it, literally, it will pain you. So give you have, whoever have issue right now, they can try. Yeah, they can try. Yep. Thank you, um, Chigna man. Uh, that reminds me uh, that you know how I find the trigger point for myself. Okay, so um, what I do is, uh, let's say if I cannot do it with the one hand, but I can do perfectly fine with this hand, right? Then I just try comparing. Okay, so I do this, 
and I press here, right? Or when I do this, I start pressing here. How do you find out if there is a trigger point? Anybody wants to answer except the Jignaven? When you apply the pressure, it will tell you that, hey, I have a pain here. It will not tell you in general, I have a pain, but when you press that like this, say, uh-uh, I have a pain here. So that's how you find. And then you do kind of a go into detail, all right? Figure it out, like, you know, half inch this way or half inch this way or the other way, right? And then say, okay, here is the most area where I press that, I feel good. Well, that's your trigger point. And then you start applying the pressure and then eventually you need to break it down, right? And there are ways to break it down. As I explained before, you can use, you know, pencil all the way to the roller. But thank you uh, for bringing that out. You yep. find if you have one healthy hand or leg or shoulder or neck, you can find the other unhealthy on your own, unless you got into the accident. That's a totally different story. So I'm doing right now. Um, and so I, I feel that, right? Um, but again, there are tons of uh, pictures available too, in case if you don't know, right? When I stretch this hand, how many muscles are involved in stretching? That is available on the internet. You just have to research. And then when you do this, perfectly fine. When you do this, I have a pain here. Look into it. Everybody has a unique problem, but the technique to find is a common. You have to feel it, break it down, and maintain it. Anybody but, else? But if we continue doing like it long, let's see. Let's see. We don't have any issue at this point, right? We are well and good. If we continue with our normal stretches and all the activities and everything, this will really um, avoid getting into that kind of problem. Right. Thank you, Ashokai. Yoga, yoga has helped a lot, right? And then slowly, this all this muscle pain, trigger point, or blockage has you know helped resolve. But then still person like me and the others uh, on this uh, uh, session, they're continuously having simply rigid given or not. Uh, and a gummium stretch curl, so it's not able to resolve it. And then you need something like this to just break it down. And once you break it down, it, and then if you continue to do yoga, yeah, it will remain healthy. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much for sharing your knowledge and your research. This was very helpful. Sure. I uh, hope it helps everybody. Yeah. Um, and we can, you know, touch base again whenever we have a few minutes in yoga, right? Uh, but hopefully, Bakul Bhai include a couple of these uh, in the yoga, like the neck stretching, right? And I'll, I, I recorded the session, so I'm going to share this into our group. So if anybody have time, sometime they can just forward and look at a specific portion back and forth, they can rewind and they can just pay attention to like whatever pose is done and those kind of things. And, and whoever not able to attend because of some other um, commitments, so even they can get benefit too. And Bakul, thank you very much for facilitating this session. This was, as usual, you have been, always been a leader in, a, in helping people, so I appreciate that on behalf of the entire group. So very good. Thank you, Diman. No, this is teamwork and it's a very good group. And that's what our plan. Okay, we're going to share the knowledge too. So we heard some great input also from you two and um, Amit and um, uh, Bharat Bhai. And like it was very good inputs and we shared some information. That was the plan. Great. Only thing was it just went over 30 minutes. So so again, close was so right? Yep. That's good. Yep. Thank you, Asok Bhai and Bakul Bhai. You did right. great. Nilam Ben. I, I listen all the way. Yeah, I'm just listening. Yeah. Thank you, Bakul Bhai. Thank you, everybody. Thank, thank you, Bakul Thank you. Ashok Bhai, Bakul Bhai, everybody. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.